Are we live? I yeah, think we're live. Oh, that's what that off air was. Now it's live. I get it. <laughs> Let me go to my YouTube channel. Let me go to my channel because it will be on my channel. And if you want to share a link, you can share a link to my channel. And then you guys host, it will be on your channel. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> there we go. We got two folks in here. Hello, hello. We're live now. Hello. <laughs> oh, and there's Diana Warner and uh, Patricia Struford. Hi, ladies. Well, this is Mary at the Marriott today, and we had a little bit of an issue. Uh, a couple <laughs> issues. I've got, my Ethernet went down for some reason, so that's why we didn't get started exactly at 2. There's Janet. Hi, Janet. And Teresa Crafting Chaos and Terry Cleveland. And okay, so I have a question. I don't see people joining. Is that just Mary that can see that? Uh, go on YouTube. Do you have another device that you can go on YouTube? No, can I just open another window? I think yeah, that's what I do. I have another okay. window open, but make sure you turn off the volume on when you go to Mary's um, live. Otherwise, okay. we'll get issue issues. Yeah. How about you, Vicky? Oh, I'm good. You You're good. All right. I was posting it in Twitter, and I've got it oh, up she's... in my iPhone. She's a Twitter girl. This is kind of a testing thing, too, um, yeah. to get Shannon and Vicki familiar with the uh, Google Hang Hangouts. And Rosemary's been on here before. Um, we're going to get her hosting. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've done it before, but never from this point. So yeah. I'm yeah. good. And now I can see it on my iPhone, so I'm good. All right. Well, let's introduce everybody. We've got, to, did you find everybody, Shannon? I see everybody now. I'm with it. All right. Well, let's start with Shannon. <laughs> so let me put you in the, let me get you there. Do I get to be the big girl now? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you'll get a little bit of lag on your YouTube. Okay. I'm lagging big time here. Yeah, I am too. There she is. Hi, Kendra. All right, this is Shannon Green. We love our Shannon Green. <laughs> what are you working on, Shannon? I am doing, um, I'm probably going to be making this little glue book. I say probably because I didn't really know what I wanted to do, so I've got this big stack of stuff. Wow. Yeah, so <laughs> I'll figure it out, right? Right. And, um, but I think I'm going to work on this little glue book. And what I want to do is take some of my watch images because I cut these out compulsively and then put little faces in them like this. Oh, how cool. You, know, and you just cut away the excess. So that's what I'm doing right now is matching up watches with faces. And then I just want to put them all in this little book. Wow. Janet says hello, Shannon. Patricia is saying hi. Sharon, hi, hi y'all. <laughs> They're all saying hi to you. Hello. So let's go to Vicky. Vicky looks like she's already working on something there. Her pan pastels. Yeah, I um, I worked in this book Thursday on my live, and decided I was liking it so much I was going to keep working in it. So. Wow. And we, I just, you went over to Rosemary's and had a pen pastel section. Yeah, that was last Saturday. And then and I saw both of them yesterday. So uh, we're just playing sick of each other already. <laughs> uh, let's just say I was tired when I got home. <laughs> How far away do you live? Oh, I, I'm just starting. <laughs> it's away from where I met them, but I was on my feet for about an hour, and I'm not used to that. Oh. Okay, let's pop over to Rosemary. And come on. on. There we go. Ooh, Rosemary has orange on her jelly plate. <laughs> you might have a little bit of lag time. Yep. Or so. There we go. 
I'm trying some new paint out. It's super thick. Ooh, it is. What new paint is it? It's from um, Speedball. Oh, it's block printing ink, right? And it's, and I'm it's, not sure that's going to roll out, Rosemary. Well, it's, it's going to. <laughs> it's like linoleum. I know, but I want it. Well, I just, I don't care. <laughs> okay. Well, all right then, just keep on rolling. I bet she rolling, 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 rolling. Exactly. I mean, keep since when? Rolling. Since when do I do things the way it's supposed to be? You're right. I am sorry, I forgot. Who That's I no was fun. To. You forgot who you were talking to. I did. Well, we'll just Never watch mind. Rosemary roll out that. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I started to get right now. What I'm, I'm working on. Um, some drywall tape. That's what I'm printing on. Let's see what she does. Ooh. So I'm just going to put the base on a whole bunch of pieces. Okay. And I'm going to do my printing later. Okie dokie. By the time I've done a few, this will all dry. You know how fast stuff dries when you've printed with oh. the like. In this heat, it sure doesn't take long. Ruth is in the house. Ruth Lamb and Mina has says hi, everybody. Hello. Hello. Hi, hey, Janet. <laughs> okay, let's pop over to Shannon. She's doing those wonderful watches. Sharon. How do we keep from talking over each other? Uh, I control that. I control the host controls. Oh, it should. Mary, be. Mary has complete control. Well, the host. <laughs> right now, I'm the host. But but when you when you host, you put the camera on different people. Okay. So. But you can hear me without it being on. Yes. Okay. Yes. So if you're doing something really interesting that you want to share with somebody or you can have a, you know, a, a hint or something, say, put me in the, put me in the spotlight, Mary, and I'll, I'll. Yeah, I was, more, I was more worried about us talking over each other. Yeah, that happens when Mary's in the room. <laughs> so okay, I have a technical question. How come on the YouTube page, like my little area looks really kind of blurry? But on the Hangout page, I'm perfectly clear. It happens all the time. I have no idea. Okay, so that's a thing. So that's a thing. Are people seeing it blurry? blurry? Whatever you're seeing on YouTube, that's what they're seeing. So if you've seen it blurry on YouTube, that's what they're seeing. Oh, why am I so blurry? But I don't what, know. What is your quality setting, Shannon? I don't know. How do I find out? Look, look at your little gear setting on YouTube. Do you have a little gear setting with the options that should have a quality? You might want to set that up a bit. Are you on Wi-Fi or Ethernet? I'm on Wi-Fi. Yeah, that could have something to do with it, too. Oh. Uh, but uh, did you find your little option setting? No. You know, do I have to go to my own YouTube, like the studio? No, you should be able on, on your... Do you have Chrome up or what do I'm you have? Chrome, I, and I never use Chrome. That's probably why I'm so low. Okay, look for a little gear down in the lower right hand side of underneath your your window. And my gear is up at the top. Oh, uh, got it. Settings. And look for quality setting. If it's like 360 or 480, and you got low quality. Try to set it to 720. I don't think is what I usually have it because my own videos come out fine. So why but, would this be? And it could be just because you're on Wi-Fi. But you know, Shannon, I'm looking at you on YouTube right now. You don't look blurry to me. I don't. Well, you don't look blurry to me either. You look great too. Uh uh that's what I, I want. I only look blurry to me. I guess yeah. so. What's your what is your quality set at? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that little gear. It's not like this is my first video, right? Like I do videos all the time. I haven't changed. 
<laughs> we know you've been in custom keeper land. So. <laughs> oh, look. Okay. I navigated away and then came back. And then now I'm not blurry. There oh, you go. Okay, Becky says I look fine. Yes. A little yeah. bright, but not blurry. Yeah, I'm sitting in front of an open window. Well, that's kind of like my Ethernet today. When I say I, I used Ethernet last night, it was fine when I turned it off. And, you know, I should have turned it on at 8 o'clock this morning, but I waited till a quarter to one, a quarter to two. <laughs> <laughs> the Ethernet was off. You think I wasn't oh saying that? Oh, blurry again. This is going to drive me crazy. Check your quality. It could just okay. be your Wi-Fi. I think I'm pretty much going to just... Um, just watch the out. Hangout so you don't get perturbed. Yeah, I'm just going to watch then, myself on the Hangout thing. <coughs> yeah. Um, you know, yeah. On, on the host, when you host, I just noticed this today when I signed in here. It says, this Hanging on, Out on Air is live. Hangouts on Air is going away later this year. For uh -oh. quick streaming... For quick streaming, try and then they give a link. Uh -oh. So I think that they're going to replace Hangouts with something else. That's what they've been saying for like a year. So I guess they're serious. Yeah, oh. yeah. Okay. But if they give a link to some other. I'm not going to hit the link now. So don't even try to figure it out yet, Shannon, because it's going to be. <laughs> that's what I'm thinking. If they're just going to change it, that's it's... just going to waste brain power. I'm, I'm, yeah. Yeah. And if you uh, if you Google the Hangout and when it's going away, you'll see that they're replacing it with like something Meet and something Chat, Google Meet or Google Chat or something like that. And I would oh, be I did a Google Meet thing recently with some other people. Yeah. And it was kind of like this. I showed up. I mean, I managed to get there, but didn't know what. You have other friends. So I have other friends. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> what was your experience on it, Shannon? I'm impressed. I mean, it was good. It was just the, the interface was completely different, but it was kind of the same concept. You know, you're all in a little box and there's a person who hosts it. And yeah. See, I, mean, I wouldn't be surprised if YouTube would get in on that. Yeah, it was just a little bit different interface, but it was basically the same. Cool. Very cool. With my other friends that I'm cheating on y'all with. <laughs> now you know. I am going to yeah. call. Vicki, I'm going to go over to you. Okay. Oh, look at what you're doing. With that pen. Now that changed just in the last few minutes. Yeah, well, I'm going to Oh, you, you flipped the page. <laughs> yeah, there's this uh, Dina Wakeley's media journal that I've had forever. So what I and I have some delusions paint that I need to get rid of or throw it away. So I put delusions paint down using a jelly plate, and then it was so bright that I came back over it with some watered down gesso, and then used some some of that new um, chalk paste. Ooh, chalk. Paste. Did a little bit of that. Did a little bit of the other, and some pan pastels. You can see, I think, over here in this corner. Who um, makes the chalk paste? Who makes what? Oh, chalk paste. I got it from Joggles. I think it's Prima. It's called Redesign. I thought I had seen Prima, but it's not showing up real good. Yes, yeah, Susan. This is Vicki on screen right now. Yeah. Yes. What I did on the burlap pages this morning was came back in with some, um, uh, what do you call it? It's like chiffon, this stuff, the real fine stuff. I have that because you can make silk screens with this and an embroidery hoop. So mm -hmm. I pour some of that and glued it down to the burlap. Next, I'm going to put some clear gesso and then I can paint Faces on this. Wow. A stencil. Cool. That'll be cool. of it. So that's how one. you're resolving the burlap issue. Yeah. Yeah. And I got that idea from Lena last night. I was watching hers. Here's another muted page. So I'm just keeping it real muted. I haven't done anything there. See how bright those delusions are? And that's not my thing anymore. 
Do and you then, have your autofocus on, Vicki? You might want to turn off your autofocus. I, it, it's just been doing that, and it is off. Oh, okay. It's just got a mind of its own. Ooh, I like yep. that page. And this is, I stenciled direct onto, this is muslin. Direct onto muslin, and then put white gesso on top of it. Wow. Well, I can come back and paint a face on that, and you know, we'll see where we get from there. So I'm just waiting on this stuff to dry. <laughs> so tell so me that's what, what I'm working on right now. What did you guys do yesterday where you were all together? Ooh. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> is that a secret meeting or is that just something you don't want to repeat? <laughs> we yeah, were gossiping about everybody we know online. We did. <laughs> oh. about everybody. Everybody. Everybody wow. is special. Wow. <laughs> now we went over to the new um, craft store that's opening up here. And um, it's the company that bought out all of the Canvas Court brands inventory oh. and they're opening up a new retail store that is just amazing wow who is that what company yeah. bought them out the, i think they're going to be called 1320 and that's not anybody that you would know um okay. they're not from the whole craft industry wow but they um the owner has other businesses that are very successful, you know, really good business mind, knows, knows how to run a business and make it succeed, already has plans for expanding. Wow. Um, yeah, I think it's going to be cool. They're having their grand opening on the 29th. Wow. So, um, grand yeah. opening of the, the brick and mortar yep. store? Yeah, the brick and mortar store. Yeah. So you know, over there and hang out. <laughs> So if we want to shop there, we have to actually go there or buy online. Yes, they, yeah. you can still get online. They'll ship anywhere, but they have this great store and we've got ideas for classes and workshops. And I'm thinking even a retreat, really? um, mm -hmm. all kinds of stuff. Very cool. Very cool. We're talking well, let's see who's in what did you say? I said with homemade Mexican food. Oh my gosh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> I've had their food. It's great. Yeah. Let's go to see who's in the house here. River City is Deborah. Hi, River City. And Tanya made it in here. Hi, Tanya. Tanya goes live Hi. tomorrow at noon. Tanya is already talking about my brayer. I'm very upset. <laughs> What is she saying about your brayer? That it's squeaky. Oh my it's gosh, squeaky. I'm glad she said it because I was going to say something. But then, and I, I, wasn't like I was being polite. I just kind of forgot. But and, yeah. and it's not even that old. I don't even know why he, he's squeaking. I think he just wants attention. And I'm saying go for it. We all have our own way of getting attention. Rosemary, I've got a squeaky chair, so... <laughs> And I even tried to buy a, a new used one, and it still squeaks. So <laughs> I love that color that you're putting on there. That's a pretty, pretty cool color. one. Yeah. Yeah. Well, let's see who else is here. Tanya and Janet and Susan Gerald. And uh, uh, let's see. And Beck. Hi, Becky. Uh, she's, she said, I'll be back watching after we stop. And visit Grant or Scott's mother. See you later. So Vicky, uh, yeah. what? Take it in. I'm telling him I'm going to squeak right now. <laughs> you don't want to hear it. Cover your ears. Squeak, squeak. Aunt Beth said that Shannon looks fine. Good. Glad to know. Yeah. Mostly it's just a touch of blurry, but here on Wi-Fi, it does have a bit of delay for me. Yeah, Wi-Fi mm -hmm. is always going to do a little bit of delaying. Let's see. I think we covered everybody else that's in here. We've got 39 folks in here watching. Good deal. Yeah, because I think... Um I forgot her name. It'll come to me. 
<laughs> not Patty. Crap. It'll come to me when I'm least expecting it. When we're off? Yeah, tomorrow when you don't need it anymore. That's okay, Vicki. I completely understand. <laughs> well, I'm going to work on my... Uh, I carved a stamp, a kitty cat stamp last night. And I, I'm making 3D tiles out of this, what you see on my desktop. But I, I carved this kitty stamp that got buried here. And I'm going to stamp it using my stays on on these report covers, I think. I'm going to test it out. And I'm going to attach them. I'm just going to tie them on like you would a tag. I think that's where I'm going with it. Well, that's what I'm up to today. These are kind of, these are not completely transparent. They're kind of a uh, little bit mil milky, but we'll try it. My stays on was dry and they told me to re-ink it with my distress uh, re-inker, my, uh, my archivers, not distress, but the archival ink. It says it's permanent waterproof, so we'll see. Yeah, I it'll work. Yeah. So that's what I'm going to be up to. Man, I like this because you you can think while you're working when you don't <laughs> have to talk all the time. <laughs> hey, well, hey. we're on you, Vicki. We're watching you now. I, I just switched it over. This is one of those bright delusions pages and i'm going over each one with uh, distress oxide and it kind of blends down if i had more white on this one it would look better but you're kind of pushing it to the background yep Let's see what peeled paint does now let's get on the back here first to see how this is going CJ just came in. Rosemary said it's paper, it. paper on both sides. That That's a drywall tape. She was telling me about it before we came live. It's to put in between the cracks of your, your drywall, Rosemary? Yep. It's just paper on both sides, and what makes it stick is your uh, drywall compound. But it's a great thickness. I really like doing a lot of different types of techniques with it. So are you making that for like washi, a big wide washi tape? Or are you going to just use it for collage? Or I have no idea yet. I don't have a real plan for it yet. But it could be all the above that you just said. Ooh, you've got a nice color on there now. Uh, it'll flip to Rosemary in a minute. <laughs> My wife all it. My Wi-Fi is really slow. Yeah. I think I'm going to re-ink this pad a little. And then after I put the base coat, then I'll come back and do some stamping. We'll see what happens there. <laughs> <laughs> Holy moly. You're going to stamp on them? I'm going to stamp on a jelly plate and then reprint what I've already got the background on and see what happens. Very I cool. don't know. Rosemary and I had so much fun last Saturday. What did I do? Oh, yeah, we had lots of fun Saturday. Didn't know what I was doing, but I had fun. Well, fill us in on it. Don't just say you have fun and then didn't tell us what. Yeah, you well, I don't I don't have any alcohol ink. So I asked Vicki if she could bring some because I know she practically owns every color that's ever been made. So <laughs> she was kind enough to bring hers over. And then we played on the jelly plate with the stencils and the ink. And oh my goodness, it came out so pretty. Now I have to figure out how to afford oh. some alcohol inks. <laughs> well, do you have some old uh, markers that are going dry on you? Because that's what I've been doing is my ink haul breaking up my old markers into alcohol 91 percent alcohol you know what i do so much of that kind of you know trash to treasure stuff i think i actually want to go and buy something <laughs> <laughs> well go to walmart and get those 10 plus here 
I'm not finding them as much in the summer because I think that they're drying out until the school supply. Mm -hmm. But they might have some of those colored ones, and you can get 30 of them for $10, which is a pretty good deal. But don't get the fine, fine point ones. Get the regular ones if you do that. Mm -hmm. um, do you want to see some of the stuff we did last Saturday? Sure. I do. Let me pop over there, Vicki. My Wi-Fi at my... Uh, uh, come on, move. There you go. Oops, where did I go? Vicki? We played with... Hold it, we put a stick on you here. It's oh, you're not there yet? No, it's being stubborn. I'm trying to put you in the... Put me in the line. Yeah. There you go. Now you should be there. It's we put it back and forth. We put the... Uh, I, I see you, Mary. Oh, there she is. We put a stencil on the jelly plate, Ooh. and then went over, went over the, took the stencil off, went over it with a light coat of white paint, and printed it. Oh. And then we put more white paint on the jelly plate, and did it again, and we got a better print that time. And we actually got three prints. Mm -hmm. Where's my other one? Off of each one. That those are really cool. And then I'll just skip that one. I can't find the third one. And then just some off prints. And I tried some with uh, clear um, like glazing medium, and that picked up really good on those. So we were just playing. You do have to use brighter colors for it to work. But yeah. look at this one. I did the black, the dark one first, and then pulled it again. I colored it the second time. I, I put the stencil back down and colored it with some of the shiny pan pastels, and then pulled it again. And then this is the third print. Isn't that neat? Yes, those are so cool. They're very, They're very cool. cool. And then I did a face just to see if it would work. And some of them are kind of scary, but um, it works. <laughs> Looks like a There's that third one. Here's the third one. Isn't that pretty? Wow. It's kind of a fresco look. And this paper was part of the charm. This was packing paper I got in the box. So they just used it, twisted it to cushion everything. And I had pulled it out and rolled it out, you know, put it in rolls. And the wrinkles on the paper really do a good job. Mm -hmm. so you can see where it's wrinkled. Yes. That's okay. so cool. Sure and tell over. Back to work. Let's go look at Shannon. She's too quiet. I'm in my zone. <laughs> in my zone i found this i got a wine spectator magazine the other day and so you know i was able to harvest lots of pictures of bottles that i love and glass which is so funny because i'm a total teetotaler like i don't drink at all you buy the wine and take the labels and i'll drink it yeah okay <laughs> <laughs> Deal. it's been some <laughs> on me I don't have any questions about alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, I found this picture of this girl in Wine Spectator. And I remembered this um, phrase that I had cut out not too long ago. And it's just a little bitty one. It says, goggles are a good idea because getting red wine in your eyes stings. And it <laughs> looks like she was just about to pour that glass of wine into her eyes. So I wanted to put her together on something. And I think this background looks good with her. <laughs> so I'm just going to stick her in here. Yes, very cool. Now you, you, you changed from your mini book where you're doing those watches. You've got all your faces in your watches. <laughs> I love that. I, I, yeah, I, you know, a little attention deficit here. I got tired of that, so I'm going to do this for a while, and then I'm going to go back to this, and then I'm going to do that other thing over there, and then yep. I'll probably come back to this. <laughs> <laughs> That's how Shannon rolls. That's how we roll. 
Well, I carved my little kitty nose. I made a scratch on its nose that I don't like, and I'm going to try to fill it up with glossy accents with a pen. And I don't know how that's going to work. I may ruin my stamp, but we'll see. Uh-oh. <laughs> the glossy accent may repel the ink. But as it is, I have to go in and color in the nose anyway, the scratch on his nose. Poor guy. Yeah. The kitty I got a big remote sprayer yesterday, 40 off. Didn't and there's a little VR nice at Hobby Lobby. That it does have a really fine spray, which I'm hoping will get me some good oxidation. Oxidize. Woo, 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 woo. My uh, my Ethernet does not want to change very. I'm trying to change to Vicky, and it's stuck on Shannon. <laughs> <laughs> A lot of people are. <laughs> <laughs> We're stuck on Shannon. Well, I have it a little sticky, so. <laughs> This is uh, when you get turned over to me. This is the bright red and yellow page I just worked on. Now it's halfway palatable. All right, we're on you, Vicky, but it might take a while for the Wi Fi to get over to you. Shannon, we're off of you now. Oh, okay. <laughs> there we go, Vicky. You're in the spotlight now. Anyway, that was the page I just started on with that bright red and orange. Yeah, really and toned, toned it down. And really toned it down. Uh, I can still whitewash a little bit, but, um, and that's done with distress ink. So I think I put some, I think I put some white paint on it first with a jelly plate. I know I did. And Holly popped did. in and uh, um, Holly and who? Oh, Azure. Hi, Azure. Hi, Holly. Welcome, welcome, ladies. Hey, guys. Hey, y'all. We've got Vicki Ross and Rosemary Morris and and Shannon. And that other girl. Yeah, that other girl. That other girl. <laughs> One that has other friends besides us. That's what I did the other day when I was introducing <laughs> Rosemary and and Vicky to someone, and I said, and this is my friend Rosemary, and there's that other one, Vicky. <laughs> They're always mean to me. <laughs> you can handle it. You're you're a good girl. Yeah. Well, let's see what that glossy accent is gonna do here. Yeah. I'm hoping it'll rain. It looks like it's going to rain. I have my rusty stuff outside. My rusty garden needs to be uh, rained on. It's been oh. looking like it wants to here, Rosemary, but it hasn't done anything. Well, they said they said 20% chance during the day, but we're going to have bad storms tonight. So. Yeah. That's what's happening up here, Rosemary. Yep. It was storming last night. Mm. Oh. I re-inked it with the little plastic cover on it. No wonder it wasn't doing anything. <laughs> <laughs> That's Oops. funny. I stamped it down and nothing came out. I'm going, I didn't put glossy accents on everything. <laughs> you know how they have that little ink protector things on the stays on? The little right. Cover. Oops. <laughs> Oops. Oopsie. So you're putting uh, pen pastel on that now, Vicky? Are you putting distress oxide? Distress oxide. Oh, okay. But you're using a, a pen pastel brush, or just what are you using to apply it with? This that is uh, that little makeup brush by Dan Thumb. Let's see. I think I still have the box out. Yeah. Why well, put anything away, and then you're just going to need it again. <laughs> I'm just to use those things. Kedsum, K E D S U M, makeup brush set. Yeah. And I've had it for about a year. 
then Lindsay Wyrick reviewed them the other day and liked them better than any other tool for putting distress ink on stuff. Wow. And they don't get dirty. Those makeup brushes can get expensive, though, can't they? Do what now? The makeup brushes. Um, when I got these, I think I got them on Amazon for about fifteen dollars, eight to fifteen. Oh, well, and I Amazon. didn't find them yesterday on Amazon. But if you'll search for Kedsum, K E D S U M, you're liable to find them with another supplier. Yeah. Okay, let's see how this will stamp on my. You know, instead of stamping, I think I'm going to go cut all these tiles apart. I'm ready to cut my tiles apart. The gals tell me that my tiles look like a linoleum floor. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going, you know, it does. But I have to move everything off. Before I cut it apart, let me go back over to me. Before I. Come on, move. Vicky, it's stuck on you now. It doesn't want to move. Oh, <laughs> it doesn't want to move between people very easy. To Oh, there we go. Let me clear everything off. No, oh, where's my phone? My Wi-Fi is lagging too. Before I clear everything off, I'm going to do a little mixing. I'm going to put just a little bit of red in this yellow. Inca hall. This is the Inca hall that I made with my markers. But the yellow is always so light. Let me get my report covers off of here. I want to spray the back. I want to spray the back of everything. Ah, I didn't realize I had so much stuff on here. I just don't have enough room. I do not have enough room. I just got this little, about what you see on my screen is what I have. Maybe a inch or two wider, but all right. I'm gonna put just a little bit of red in my yellow because I don't like my yellow. Just a teeny bit here, and see if I can't get a coral color, sort of, kind of. Sort of mixing in there a little bit more. So, and then I'm going to spray this entire sheet with my Inca halls, and then I'm going to cut them apart. The Inca hall dries really fast. Hi, Beth. Beth Schuler's in the house. Hey, Beth. <laughs> oh, I got eraser scrapings from last night. Um, what's everyone doing? Well, let me let me take it off of me and show you. Here we have in the house Rosemary Morris. As soon as I get over to her. <laughs> It doesn't want to flip there as good as it usually does. I must have a really slow Ethernet. It's really going slow for me. It won't get off of me now. <laughs> it's stuck. Come on, Rosemary. There you go. Whoops. No oops. There. Rosemary Morris. Yes, and, oh, she's stamping on them now. She did some jelly plating on drywall tape. And now she's going in and, and she put, was that black paint that you put on there, Rosemary? Yeah. And what stamp are you using? Uh, one that I made with the uh, fun foam. Ooh, oh, is that so, a foam? Is that a foam stamp? Is that that foam stamp you did? Yeah. So this is how that one's coming out. I like how this looks. It looks exotic. Woohoo! Ooh, baby, baby. And then let me see. I did another one that didn't come out as well, but oh, I like that. Ooh, that. Ooh. And then I did my little stamp that I had done. That one halfway came. I love how that came out. Oh, oh yeah. So we're getting there. 
I'm not sure where we're getting, but we're getting there. <laughs> oh, I think it's cool. I saw that uh, live stream where you made those foam stamps. That was fun, huh? Was that the one where you were telling about the airplane trip? <laughs> You know, I gab so much. I don't know what I'm talking about half the time or when I said it. So I, I have no idea. <laughs> I giggled so hard in that. <laughs> Rosemary worked for a marketing company and they sent her. You had to fill in for somebody who was neglected, neglected their duties. And so yep. there was Rosemary. I'll go. <laughs> I love to fly. <laughs> Wrong. <laughs> and so she gets on this airplane and all the stewardess, well, that's when you were landing. All the stewardess were buckled back down for the landing and Rosemary was still picking up surveys. <laughs> oh, dear. I can't make the, you have to do the ro the airplane sounds, Rosemary. You do those oh, good. Dear. <laughs> I don't want, I don't want to get, you know, have an anxiety attack right now. I'm having fun. You're, <laughs> you're bringing back my anxieties in my life. <laughs> Let's pop over to Shannon Green in a minute as soon as it decides it wants to go there. There's Shannon Green. Oh, I'm the big girl now. Yep. She's working. She's a big girl working in the little mini journal now. Yeah, the big girl with the little book. And I glued down one of my girls um, on a watch face and colored the background with some Poscas and then a little rubber stamp. Very cool. And I pulled out some stamps, which I, I rarely do anymore. But, um, yeah, I'm, I'm revisiting my rubber stamp collection. Well, Shannon, we would love to see more videos from you. I know everybody would. Oh, uh, I would love to make more videos. <laughs> I just need to find some some hours where I can do it. And then the hours that I do have where I could actually do it, I just want to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> well, you have a life. You I have, have a lot going on right now. Yeah. And we're just telling you we miss you. I appreciate it very, very much. But we know you're a busy lady. I am busy, which I guess is good. I don't know it's good. Um, yeah, but it does kind of kind of eat into my time that I have to do the things that I want to do as opposed to the things that I have to do. Yeah. Well, we appreciate your coming in here this afternoon because you could probably be doing 10 million other things. And you, you know, do. I really needed a break. So thank you for inviting me. This just worked out perfect. Well, that was actually Vicki. I was too chicken to invite you. We need somebody with clout. <laughs> oh, that's a funny one. <laughs> We need somebody who she actually listens to. <laughs> Funny thing is, I'll listen to pretty much anybody. <laughs> that was a you do that. my panel and do this, and I'm like, okay. It's <laughs> like surprisingly easy. Yeah, but you gotta know how to award the request. Are you in the mood to play tomorrow afternoon? Yeah. <laughs> and then after Shannon, we've got. Vicki Ross. Vicki, it's coming on you now. In a minute, when the Wi-Fi switch is over. <sighs> there you are. And Vicki's working in an art journal. Yeah. I didn't know what to do with this book. And I have the big one, too. So I figured it wouldn't hurt to use one. I'm just toning down some Delusions paints that I want to re, I want to use them so I can get, I want the drawer they're in, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, how many times have y'all done that? I mean, you use something just because you need the container that it's in. <laughs> you like oh. the jar? Is that what you said? You want the jar they're in? No, the drawer. Drawer. The drawer. Oh, I want the jar. No, I want everything within arm's reach, you know? And that's just not possible. My arms aren't long enough. 
Yeah. Boy, you know, and visible. That's what I want. I saw a video where they make a little uh, flip out extension to a desk. And I'm going to see if my brother can't make that for me. Just so that I can. When I'm doing a live stream, I put all my things on the floor behind me. Mm -hmm. You know, and I'm having to turn my chair and I bump into things. And it drives me nuts. Um, the, and then that will get piled high and you won't want to empty it when you leave the room. Well, I'll have to because we can't get to the little, little closet after. Wow. I mean, I work at maybe about a three by five desk area. It's it's tiny. Okay, I need my trimmer. So I had Ethernet issues. Uh, when we started here, so that's why we were late getting started. So, but after I said enough <clears throat> bad words, it decided to work. I, I wish I could have heard Mary say a bad word. Me too. <laughs> I, I hate it. I hate it for that one. I'm human. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but you have excellent self-control. I just don't want to be, you don't hear it because I don't want to be demonetized. That's what's, <laughs> I don't want to get punished. It's all about the dollars and cents. When I'm alone, there's nobody to demonetize me, so. <laughs> yeah, it's amazing how demonetized of about $4 a month. <laughs> do more to make you shut up than your mother ever could. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> well, and the other thing that YouTube does is they take away my subbies. Except lately they've been good about that. So taking away your subscribers? Yeah. The I lose I'll gain I'll gain three and lose two. I'll gain three and I'll lose two. You know, it's that thing. And they say, Well, we we periodically go in and clean out spam and I'm going periodically must mean every day because the way it bots around if I kept count of all the subbies that I lose every day I'd probably lose 40 subbies a month you know I'd be tempted to say I'll handle my own spam thank you very much yeah but I just don't think that many I don't think that I have that many bots hitting my channel you know so but whatever well, what they what they do is if the person doesn't view your videos X amount of time within X amount of time, they knock them out. Well, so, there you go. So if you subscribe to somebody and then you know you go a whole month or so, you're longer and you don't view them, then you're not getting notifications. You wonder why? Well, it's because they've removed you, <laughs> and so there you go. They don't count for the fact that you might actually have a life and, you know, be doing. Of course not. <laughs> oh, well. There we go. We kicked some people out of my Facebook group. Oh, no. A oh, bunch of God. people. Yeah. They're but starting they a new thing. That if you're not active, they're going to start kicking you out. I was go, okay, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> I, won't I, thought I, I thought I had the choice of who I kicked out of my own group. <laughs> I won't remove the people that are making fake videos. That's the bad part. Yeah. yeah. I don't know. I don't do know. I'm really curious about that company that bought out. Did they buy everything, Shannon? They bought out, was it Seven Gypsies or was it the whole kit? Right. Yeah, what they did, they bought the um inventory and assets so like the equipment all the inventory so they they do have seven gypsies and tattered angels and those are going to continue on and and hopefully even improve um, as well as the canvas cut and sew what they did not buy is the company they did not buy canvas court brands the corporation oh and so that's really caused a lot of confusion because so that company is still owned by the previous owners. So they're still responsible for anything that has to do with the corporation, um, you know, including debts and things. And um, 
Also the design team that stays with Canvas Court Brands, not the new company. Um, so yeah, basically Canvas Court Brands just sort of quit, shut the door, ceased operation. And then the yeah. new company came in and saved the assets and inventory. Huh. And they can continue to make the Tattered Angels paint. paint. Yes, yeah, they, they can continue. They have the, they own the intellectual property rights, you know, and all that for the designs and the, the formulas. And um, it just, I'm, I am actually really excited about it because they just have some great plans, they have great ideas, they have a beautiful store. And they're just really great people. And they are like they going to be in? Are they going to be in Fayetteville? They are in Springdale. Springdale. Okay. Springdale, still Northwest Arkansas. Same town. Um, it's really it's about like a ten minute drive from my house. Wow. And, um, More like an hour from mine. <laughs> from Rosemary. But it's in a shopping center. It's in the same shopping center as a Hobby Lobby, which Ooh. on one hand is kind of like it competition but on the other hand i think it's going to be a good thing because hobby lobby will just you know drag in all the traffic yeah and then they can go over to a locally owned craft store which is such a rare thing nowadays it is and we'll have famous teachers there teaching <laughs> yes yeah there's going to be some big names <laughs> yes absolutely like, like Vicki Ross is in the house. In the house. <laughs> I, just do what, I just do what Shannon tells me. <laughs> I'm not bopping around. Let's go to Rosemary. Yeah, there what? can't be there can't be too many strong women in the same room. So I just be the little bumper. <laughs> Sorry about that. We all can. We all handle each other. We all acquiesce to one another. Oh, well, yeah. we do, and we kind of take turns because we're all tired of being in control all the time. <laughs> yeah, I'm. I'm over that. <laughs> I know, because I'm like, okay, Rosemary, let's do another class together. So, um. Now you come up with something and you know you make the prototype and you decide what we're gonna do and then just let me know. <laughs> I go, I go when, when are we doing this class? I don't know. I go, oh, great. You just you don't know what we're doing, when we're doing it, what we're doing it with, but we're gonna do it together. This is this we're gonna do it together, but Rosemary's gonna figure it all out. <laughs> Well, I'm sure with the three three of your heads together, you'll come up with something. Oh, yeah, a big head. <laughs> a big head. <laughs> That's about it. <laughs> Actually, um, I caught Rosemary taking something out of their trash yesterday. Stop <laughs> it. <laughs> what did you do, Rosemary? What I am the do? trash queen, you know. Give me a break. She well, what did you get? What did I get? Yeah, well, I wasn't sure what it is. I knew it was interesting. And then, of course, the two intellectual ladies there with me brought it <laughs> to my attention that it was a big old giant bundle of Tyvek. So I'm going, hello, score. <laughs> Look at that. They wrap up um, the, the fabric that they get that they work on there is brought in on these big giant bundles. And um, they're wrapped up in this really cool stuff. And it just turned out to be Tyvek. And they just throw it in the trash. Can you believe it? Crazy people. <laughs> <laughs> they throw it in the trash. Oh, my no, goodness. I did. But Man. they at least gave you access to it, Rosemary. Well, they didn't have a choice. We were just rummaging through their trash. <laughs> It, it well, wasn't like, not the the ladies, is there anything here you'd like? No, they didn't say that. <laughs> I, just go, I just looked at the trash can, grabbed it, and Shannon gave me the look like, what the heck are you doing, Rosemary? <laughs> <laughs> it's trash. Who cares what I'm doing with it? And I acted like I didn't know either one of them. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not with them, huh? No. Nope. The point. 
the point was these people do not know the value of trash. I don't know how they're going to stay in business, but you well, know, no, let's don't teach them the value of their trash. That way, we're going to liberate it from the. We're going to liberate it. Yeah, and I've been I've been saving my canvas cork stuff. I didn't want to run out. Yeah. <laughs> and they reach out for it. <laughs> Instead of having here's some samples, right now. Well, this is watching you, Rosemary. You're in the, uh -oh. you're in the spotlight. Well, um, I'm gonna dry this off a little bit so I can pull all this up with a different color because it looks pretty cool. That stamp that you made, that foam stamp you made, is really, really cool. Yeah, they're fun. Yeah. Now, was that, uh, that's just like foam you can get at the kids section, you know, the yeah. regular foam sheet? Yeah, the fun foam. And it, I got the one with the sticky back. So then I just peel and stick it onto some cardboard to give it a little bit of, you know, be firm. How thick is it? Is it like a fourth inch or thinner? Oh, than no. A... It's super thin, maybe an eighth. Really? Oh, you mean, you mean the cardboard or the foam? The foam. Oh, no, it's super thin. Probably like the eighth. I mean, a. Uh, yeah, probably an eighth of an inch. Really? And it prints that well. That's pretty And cool. then, you know, after you squish it a few times, it's even thinner. <laughs> <laughs> after you smush it down. Huh? Smush it, yes. You know, the smush factor. Okay, let me see. What color am I going to put on there? I, I think know. I'm Gold? always partial to... I have to go get up to go get it. <laughs> Teal is fine. Is that teal that you're shaking yeah, up there? Like the turquoise is called coastal waters. Coastal waters. I like those colors. Yeah. Absolutely. I like those colors too. Yeah. There's no real color that I hate. I even like browns, you know, different shades of browns. Yeah. They're pretty. And I even like green. <laughs> <laughs> well, Shannon's kind wrong. of partial to green, aren't you, Shannon? You no. Know, you would uh -oh. think I would be. But What's your color, color, Shannon? What's that? What color are you partial to? That is so hard to say. I like a nice teal. Teal. Mm -hmm. Not too blue, not too green. Just uh, right. Yeah. But I, I'm really, I'm like, you know, never met a color I didn't like. I even like orange. Who likes orange? I don't know. I do. I like orange. <laughs> I like orange. I like all different kinds of turquoises. Yeah. The bluer ones, the green ones, anything that would go under the umbrella of turquoise. How about you, Vicki? I'm a Are cool you? gal. A I lot like blues and purples and some greens. Ooh, cool. Tanya was asking, what was the Tyvek wrapped around that Rosemary got? I don't fabric. know. What. Big bundles of fabric. And they had poodles rolls. that weren't open yet. So it, it, <laughs> giant, giant rolls of canvas and burlap. And like, like a upholstery fabric. Yeah, like really giant rolls like that you can't, you have to lift with a truck. If you look at the roll, it was probably, what, maybe... 18 inches across in diameter at least at least maybe four thick. or five feet long maybe yeah i'd say at least so, five feet so the tyvek was wrapped all around those and sealed obviously so it won't get wet or dirty or anything yeah there. they're they're um imported that way oh i have import tyvek oh my yeah. god yeah, they were imported that way and they didn't even open them yeah, no, nope. they're imported, sealed up, stamped on the outside, you know. Um, Hopefully there's no dead bodies inside. Oh, oh my God. goodness. And they didn't even open them. Nope. Not oh. until they need it. We only open media mail. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. <laughs> well then you got it straight from the from the import uh the importer. The um, they probably get it from a distributor. From the distributor, okay. Yeah. Most likely, I don't know for sure. Wow. I do know they use imported. Wow. 
Yeah, it's a manufacturing situation, Mary. Oh, manufacturing deal. Okay. Yeah, because they make blank canvas things for companies that want their logo on it and that sort of thing. Huh. Well, you know, they should wise up because they could sell a lot of that stuff to the mixed media artists. Hey, be quiet, Mary. <laughs> what are you trying to do? <laughs> Man, if people be like you really monetize <laughs> retraction. It's <laughs> people like you that really get under my skin. <laughs> <laughs> Mary, oh, looking out for the company and not the little guy. Man. Mary, that's what they do. They they do well. Part of their market is crap stuff. <laughs> well, I I like the clearance sales, but you know if Rosemary wants to go dumpster diving, I'll shut my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> well, what was really cool is the dumpster was indoors. I didn't even have to like let people see what I was doing. <laughs> <laughs> I like that kind of dumpster diving, indoor yeah. dumpsters. Well, I got all my little tiles cut. Vicky, what are you doing? Let's pop over to Vicky. Ooh. Well, I'm um, Ooh. printing pen pastels through a stencil on one of these pages that I've distressed. Oh, wow. Look at that. You can barely see it, but that's okay. Oh, oh that's that's awesome. Awesome. You need to put maybe some texture paste on it and then color your texture paste between the texture paste. Good. Is that over burlap? Uh, no, this is... I think this is... Oh, it's the craft paper. Oh, you think it would show up more on a craft paper? Huh. Well, you know, the back side of it's crap. That's weird. Huh. Oh, no. My waste basket's in the way here. Okay. I think I'll put some washi tape on this thing next. So who has a good story to tell our audience? <laughs> oh, gosh. Um, I'm going to stay on the air, right? <laughs> Remember, we're hangouts on air. Yeah. yeah. Hey, that it's kind of got rid of. We can pass all we want to. <laughs> yeah, let's get, let's get married demonetized. Yeah. Well, I'll tell you, it, it, uh, one video probably wouldn't be bad. <laughs> I see. Do you guys watch Twitter, the Twitter YouTube help? And you get these people saying, all of a sudden I signed in and my channel's been taken down. What did I do? You know, that type of thing. Do you guys yeah. see that? No. Uh -huh. Oh. That's what I'm worried about. Sometime logging in and discovering I no longer have a channel. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, that was it's possible. possible. Yeah, they do what they want, don't they? I probably insulted the artificial intelligence engine somehow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Let's see. I'm going to washi tape this guy, I think. So let's go out and look at, let's see. Jacqueline came in. Jacqueline, Jacqueline. They're all Jacqueline Cyrus. She says, hi, Fibs. Asher's in the house. Tanya's here. Tanya says, that's yummy, Rosemary. Ooh, food. Where? I'm still on. Uh, I'm just scrolling back through chat. I'm still on Vicky. She's still in the spotlight. Susan says, I still like bright colors. She's stuck in the 60s and 70s. Tanya said, they often wrap rolls of cotton in the fields here in it. Rows of cotton in the fields here in it. They must be talking about the Tybeck. I've never oh, seen where it goes. Yeah. Let's see. Aunt Beck was here. I always miss Aunt Beck. I always see Aunt Beck's messages where she says, I'll be back in a minute. Yeah. 
All right. I never actually see her. <laughs> oh, Aunt Beck says, now, Mary, we know you don't care for pink. I I really don't care for pink that much. I'll use it, but pink is not my go-to color. You know? So I, I used to like, actually hate pink, and now it's kind of growing on me. It must be old age or something. Yeah, yeah. it must be old age. <laughs> oh, dear. You're like, look, I'm doing pink right now. I just noticed. What oh, that? wait. Let's go to Rosemary. What let's am see. I doing pink for? What are you doing? Oh, but that's a dark kind of a mauve pink. That's a dusty pink. We it's like that pink. See, this got it's printed the in gum pink. Thing. Well, I was thinking that I was trying to. I'm doing contrast, so I was wanted to do my yellow one. So I thought the pink would look pretty good on that. <laughs> it's working. It's all working. It's all working. Ooh, it's cool, Rosemary. Work it, people. Let's work it. I love that yellow strip with the yeah. All right, so now I got to dry this. You always come when I'm drying, <laughs> like literally. <laughs> You're watching me dry paint. That's really boring. <laughs> what did Rosemary do on the stream? Oh, she dried a bunch of paint. I really like what you're doing there, though, Rosemary. Thank was that you. through? A, was that through? That was through like a stencil. With the no, that's another one of my stamps I made. Oh, really? That's oh, another yeah. foam stamp. Well, I didn't make this one, actually. This was a swap we did a long time ago, and yeah. Farrah Jackson made this one. Oh, that was a Crazy Island Family swap, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So I put the name because I knew I'd never remember who did it. I get I, it. I'm really bad about that. So. I am, too. I don't remember anything past five minutes ago. That's why you asked me if I remembered the journal I made you. Yeah. <laughs> Like, yeah, I think I do, Mary. <laughs> I like that journal. I left it in Wisconsin, though. I like the format. I like making that. I think I'm going to make some more. I haven't made that yeah. in a lot of time. You should. Make some more. Fun. Well, let's see. I think you better put somebody on that's actually doing something. I'm just fanning <laughs> paint here. You to mean dry. like Shannon? Yeah, there you go. Shannon put too. Shannon on. Oh, she's working in her watches spaces. Yeah, I'm still another. Hey, Selena. Hey. How are you doing? Hey, Lena. I got my package. I love it, like always. Armor Fabricues. Hello, hello. A M O U R Fabricues. F A B R I S. Selena, she's very supportive of our group. She doesn't, um, she's really? a sewer, she's a seller. She mm -hmm. finds cool stuff that she knows we're all going to want. <laughs> <laughs> she, she, does knows giveaways. Your she does giveaways. Her last big giveaway, she gave away a brand new sewing machine. <gasps> no. Yeah, wow. That was her second one that she gave away. Wow. So she's serious. She's not fooling around. Wow. Yeah. She says, art fun today. That's me, Selena. Well, yes. welcome. Welcome, welcome, Selena. I I need to get over to your group more, Rosemary. Well, just go over there and uh, subscribe to her, and then you'll get the notifications oh when she's doing that. Like she's doing a little mini giveaway right now. All you do is comment. Or buy something and you get thrown in there. She gives a little giveaway every week. But that sewing machine thing, that's like, I think like once a year or something. But that's very Let cool. Let me subscribe. Yes. You got a new subby, Selena. She's very generous. Wow. I think I am, but I'm not sure. I need to go look, Selena. Live with Charlie. Weekly giveaway with Charlie. Charlie must be her son. Legitimate. Oh, it's her grand. That's her grandson visiting right now. Oh, her grandson. <laughs> oh, she looks young enough to have it be her son. <laughs> oh, I know. You, yeah. If you see her and her daughter next to each other, um, I guess that's her younger daughter. But still, that's even worse. It's her younger daughter, <laughs> and they look like their sisters. So, not so. making me love Selena. I just have to say. <laughs> well, welcome, Selena. She says, ha, 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 that was funny. <laughs> <laughs> Jennifer Jane just came in the house. She yeah. says, hi, ladies. 
Jennifer. Rosemary says, Jennifer. She's my sweetie. <laughs> She's my sweetie, too. Woo. See, they all right. come to watch you guys. I see lots of new people. They're yeah. my people. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, Tom, I'm, 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 kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I don't own anybody. Are you being possessive now, Rosemary? Well, of course. I got to take care of my people. <laughs> Absolutely. Okay, this thing might take forever to dry. I'm so almost dry. Oh, my goodness. Oh, Journey. I loved your journal. Journey says, I know now, Becky, but not when I sent Mary a pink journal. I love that journal. It was the right color of pink. When other people use it, I don't like, I must do something to pink. <laughs> I destroy it somehow. <laughs> How do you Journey, buy the wrong color of pink? Journey maybe? Stoneman is a wonderful artist. She does beautiful, beautiful work. I know, I've seen her. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Look me in red. I can't. Other people use red. It looks great. I use red. It's like instant blood splatter. <laughs> you can't make it not look like a horror movie scene. Yeah, yeah, right. I, I totally get that, Shannon. <laughs> Straight of Dexter. Yeah. yeah, it's a Dexter kill room. Anytime I pick up red. <laughs> uh, Jennifer, let's see, let's see who was in here that said she was a. Uh, I missed it. Yeah. Um. Somebody else that knows you, Rosemary. Oh, oh, who, who, who? Well, I know Lisa. Yes, hi, Lisa. Yeah, Lisa. Lisa Jameson. She says she's a Rosemary peep. Okay, so, Mary, I just now got off my chair, went across the room to get some gold for you. Oh, so I'm gonna... oh, well, let's just bop over to you, and then we're going <laughs> to see what Vicky's doing. I got to see what you. Ooh, you're gonna put rose. You're gonna put gold on that. Ooh. Yeah, that's what I already took up. You know, and did my stamping on on here. Uh huh. Ooh. So now I let that all dry. Now we're gonna pick up. Okay. Pick it up and see what happens. Alrighty. Okay, mm okay. Here we come. Squeaky time. I'm watching. I don't know why this roller is squeaking because it's not like it's old. So. <laughs> You know, like me. So Sounds I don't like know. Mouse. It just and it leaves lines. Look at the lines it leaves. I don't know. I must have like I don't do too well with um brayers. Um Selena says, Rosemary, feel free to post on my G B group when you ladies go live. I will be there. Oh, okay. Fantastic. Thank you. What's a G B group? Say G, what? G is in B. G oh, is in. She, she just wrote it wrong. She means your Facebook group. Oh, okay. Yeah. It right. probably auto corrected for her or something. Okay, let's see if this works. I did the big build up. Let's see what happens. <laughs> <laughs> it's too much to build right here. It's I have oh, to have the air conditioner bro. on. Mary, you're going to like pink now. <gasps> oh. You oh, like I kind of like that. Yeah. Ready. Look at that. I might have to do a second pull because there's some stuff left. Well, all I have to say, Rosemary, is gold fixes everything. I think so. <laughs> you taught you taught me that a long time ago watching you. Gold your, fixes everything. Your gold this, the gold that. I'm going, oh my goodness, she's the gold queen. I think I picked that up from Shannon. She used to say yellow oh, ochre fixes God, everything. Yeah. Shannon it's Shannon. Yellow ochre fix what ails you. I'm getting I'm getting tired of hearing Shannon did this, Shannon did that. Yeah. <laughs> oh, well, Shannon's God. been been around forever, so you know. Oh, yeah, that old Shannon. Oh, okay, I know. <laughs> she has oh, to take okay. a little responsibility for her. Yeah. Yeah. I, you know. I understand. <laughs> you know, one. I get it. Okay. Uh, we're going to watch the second poll, and then I'm going to go check out Vicky. Yeah, get out of here. No, not. <laughs> look at your, your brayers leaving streaks. <laughs> I tell you, it's not working out for me. <laughs> you don't have to point that out to me, Mary. 
Uh, Beth Schiller says, Rosemary, you're tilting the handle down too much. Tilt it up and raise your hand upward. You Is it right uh, in the sweet? Now we got briar rules. Oh, look at that blue. <laughs> look at the gold. It's not picking up what's down there, though. Hold on. Let me put it back down. Now, Beth, I, I, I was flipping it over. Okay, I'm going <laughs> to flip it over. <laughs> then the little I don't know what, flip, which, which, what she's oh, telling you, the paper oh, the briar. The little feet will hit it if I tip it over. Okay, we'll do, we'll we'll try some brayer etiquette in a second. Hold on, brayer etiquette. <laughs> we need a list of brayer etiquette. I think Rosemary, you're the only person I know who needs step by step instructions <laughs> and diagrams on how to operate a <laughs> brayer. <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm pathetic. I need sympathy. <laughs> You're not pathetic. There's I no need, way you're pathetic. I need help. I need help. I need help. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now watch, ladies. Now watch. Okay, now listen. Okay, I ha I usually do it like this. Squeak, watch how you squeak, treat that gold sheet of paper. Squeak, 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 squeak. And if I turn it over, then these things are going to make even bigger lines. <laughs> All those little <laughs> Those little the bars. Little feet, the little feet. Little bars. So see if I go straight up, I go like this. It just doesn't matter. So what to, you, um, well, tonight I'm going to WD for it to death and see what happens. Yeah. Can't do it now because it'll be greasy on my thing. <laughs> oh, well. Okay, move on. Go to, go okay, to Vicky. Okay, let's go check Vicky out. Let's see what's Vicky's. Let's, let's check out Vicky. Oh, she's on her her page that she muted down. Yeah, well, all of them are getting muted. Yeah. I put some uh, pan pastel stencils on here. Really neat. Doing it this way, you can really see the layers. I don't know if y'all can or not. It's still on Rosemary. It's stuck. No, it's on you. It's on you. I see you. I'm seeing you rolling, rolling, rolling. Well, rolling. you have a big lag because you're on you're on YouTube right now. <laughs> you're on, Vicky. You're on, Vicky. Just keep talking. You're on. Okay. Anyway, you can see all the the layers peeking through. And I put a little, yeah. see a little stencil at the bottom. Can't see. There we Ooh, it's kind of kind of all muddly. I don't see the details. Yeah, I didn't want you to. Okay, thank you. <laughs> if I decide to paint something on top of it, this one's already been sealed with clear gesso. I'm leaving that one for a while. Oh, look at this one needing to be toned down. Woo! So is that all you're doing this afternoon is toning down your pages, Vicky? Yeah, that's you're, kind of fun. You're making them be quiet. That is really I could start a face. I could start a face. Yeah, start a page for us. We want to see you do. We want to see things. something. We all know what paint on a page looks like. We want to see something. Oh, some we love thing. what she's doing. We love what she's doing. We love what you're doing, Vicky. You gotta get the you gotta get it cool first. <laughs> I love those backgrounds. You're doing backgrounds is what you're doing. I wanna see stuff. Okay. Uh Mina said, Can we see Mary? So I'm going to bop on and show you where I'm at. How much did you pay her for that? <laughs> Lots. Okay. All my YouTube earnings. <laughs> okay, I'm working on my tiles. I got them split apart, cut apart, and I want to put washi on them next. And I picked out some different washi tapes because one of the prompts, this is from Aunt Beck's Dirty Dozen. So I, I detiled my linoleum floor. Deconstructed it, I guess, would be the rosemary term for it. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. And uh, then what I want to do, and what I might do right now, is set these aside and do some stamping on those report covers with my, if I can find my stamp again. What did I do with my stamp? 
Did I set it aside too? Oh well, I might have to find my stamp. I set it aside. What did I do with it? Here's my ink. Well, I'll come back to that. So that's what I'm at. Uh, well, that's basically what I'm up to. But I'm going to have to look for my stamp. So I'm going to go back to Shannon. <laughs> We're going to watch Shannon's is deconstructing okay. a box, a Kleenex box. Yeah, my Kleenex box has the shiny silver inside. Mm -hmm. Ooh. And I've never seen a Kleenex box with shiny silver on the inside. Well, you need to buy um, it's a royal snuff with Vicks. With Vicks? Smell. Yeah, they smell just like Vicks, you know? Wow. So, um, well, they do at the beginning of the box. By the end of the box, they just smell like Kleenex. Really? But, yeah, the Vicks smell is really nice at first. And I don't know if they're, if this silver lining is to help with the maintain the smell or what, but this is really pretty. Really? I'm going to look for one of those. <laughs> so what are you going to do with that deconstructed box? Uh, I don't know. Right now I'm just using the some of the silver off of it if I can peel it down far enough. Okay. The silver. Well, we're going to watch you work for a little bit oh. while I look for my stamp. Okay. okay. I don't know what I did with my fiddle. How can I lose things in three feet of space? I just don't know. I can do it. And it always happens while I'm live. <laughs> <laughs> I think that has something to do with it. The way it goes. I have lost my... an exacto knife behind her ear. <laughs> <laughs> Try doing that one. Out. Who did that? Vicky. Vicky put an exacto knife behind her ear? Oh, yeah, don't mess with her. Ouch. <laughs> well, you don't put the blade part behind your ear. <laughs> <laughs> the window part. But what if you're paying attention to your chat folks and forget that you have an ear? <laughs> Sucks uh, that's been, that was about 30 years ago when I was young and dumb. <laughs> now she puts it between her lips. <laughs> well, I don't know what happened to my kitty cat stamps. So maybe if I just quit worrying about it and move on, it will show up on its own. Isn't that something? I wonder if it fell over the cliff. Let me get up and look. No, I don't see it. Huh. Oh. Maybe I'll just... Huh. Maybe I'll just tear up. The other thing I wanted to do today, the other thing I wanted to do today was, let's see. Where's the next? You know, I just, I get things out and I'm all ready and then I don't know where I put it. Did that happen to you? Mm-hmm. I'm glad I'm not the only one. No, nope, not by any means. Let's see. Oh, here it is. I'm going to put it over on me for just a minute because I'm going to show you guys what. I, if I stop thinking about the kitty cat stamp, it'll show up. I'll just ignore it. It's hiding from me. There you go. But now I have to put my glasses back on. Okay. <laughs> so... When I started, let me go back over here. I'm on me now. When I started making these alcohol inks, I have so many bl extra blacks because I use black all the time. Of course, now I'm pulling. I want to pull out my. So I got this kind of a half bottle of alcohol ink. It's not full. It's probably about up to 
here. It's probably about half full. And I've been taking apart all my 10 plus gears and just throwing the black in there. And someday I'm going to have a total black ink. And that, so that's what I'm going to do now because I can't find my ticket stamp. So I'm going to make some more black ink while I'm here. So, and I go through these pin plus gear pins like crazy because they're only 22 cents a pin. I'm going to get all of these out and ready. The chisel markers are a little bit harder to open, so I'm not going to do those here. So, no, I'm done. I'm done explaining me, so let's go to somebody who's actually, let's go back over to Rosemary. Oh, ooh, black and gold. Look how that one came up, the cleanup one. Pretty cool. Wait, wow. wait, Rosemary, I'm lagging, so let's, oh, there. Oh, wow, that was a cleanup one? Yeah, I did. Oh, um, Look at that. I did the stamping on here. I picked up the ink from there and stamped it on here. And then what I was left with was that to clean up. Isn't that cool? That is beautiful. Gorgeous. Yes, ma'am, it is. Gorgeous. Just gorgeous. 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 <laughs> I have three, no, four more strips, I think, to do. And then I'll be done with this. I'm getting bored with it. I got to move on to something else. <laughs> <laughs> I'm surprised I stayed this long with it. That's because everybody in the world's watching you. Mm. That's, oh, why, oh, that's no. why I should move on. <laughs> <laughs> move on, Rosemary. Move on. Move on. Vicki, are you painting a page for us now? Not yet. I've got a. I'm about okay. ready. I'll holler. Okay. Let's watch Rosemary a little bit more. She's doing her beautiful stamping with. I that. got one of my regular stamps, not not one I made, just a oh. box stamp. It's a Oops. feather stamp. How pretty is yeah, that? A peacock feather. Wow! Ooh, pretty. Ooh. Ooh, very pretty. Very pretty. Pretty. Okay. So how much of that drywall tape have you actually used? Oh, no, I, I don't know. I mean, it looks the same. <laughs> What's left? <laughs> it looks the same. <laughs> Uh, it goes a long, long way. I love that stamp. That's cool. I have a um a giveaway in my Facebook right now, and the thing is they have to make a a postcard made out of you know trash yeah and I've already got a few of them I'll show them right now in a second they're so oh, okay cool. they're really cool what they're coming up with gotta let that dry so I can do a pull off of that so let me see like Rosemary is getting postcards from the giveaway and she's gonna show them here and watch me drop it on my jelly plate <laughs> This is from Bess. Hold it. Let me switch over so I can see what you guys are seeing. Yeah, it's oh. there. Now it just came up. All right. Oh. And it says, Dear Madge, wish you were here. Having a wonderful time, Aunt B. Oh, <laughs> she looks like a mermaid because she's got all the little fishies and all kinds of stuff in there. Oh. And... This was cool too. Wait, we got a lot of lag time here. At yeah. least I do. So give yeah. us. Time to... 
And then, um, hold on, because we are, let me cover, in my group, I don't care if the address is showing, but here I don't want it to. Yeah. Anyway, this is by Peggy. This is really cool. It's a flip side of that one. Oh, wow. Look at that. Yeah. That's I nice. like to call her Fitz. I love that. <laughs> That's my nickname for Peggy. Fitz. Okay, well, let's see. This is the back side. Pretty colorful. Yes, uh, very nice. And look, my favorite elephant. <laughs> oh, wow. Isn't that yeah. cool? Yes. It just popped up on my Wi-Fi, though, so I'll hold it there for a minute so I can see it. Amy's Colorful Creations just came in, and, and Linda McAllister's in the house. Hi, Linda. Hello. This is from Terry. And this is from Cheryl. This is, um, this is paper. But look at she did um, the stitching on the oh, machine wow. on that. Oh, wow. Isn't that cool? Yes. I love that paper. I wonder what it is, what it came from. And then in the back, she covered the whole thing with fabric on the sides. Her and I, our favorite things is mixing paper with fabric. So that's pretty cool what she did there. Don't you just, aren't you amazed by all the creativity that happens? It yeah. just, you know, these gals who don't think they're creative, they're just plain wrong. <laughs> and this is from um, Christy, and she said, this card is made from an uh, the packaging from a purchased plant at the grocery store, and she bought the herb rosemary, and she put that on there. Isn't that cute? Yeah, I love it. Isn't that cool? I love it. Yeah. Anyway, so those are the ones I've gotten so far. Wow. And it's fun seeing them, you know, the different creativity, you know. Yes, absolutely. And plus, it's an easy way to make people send you postcards. <laughs> yeah, that's what it's all about right there. you got to bribe them. I'll give you something if you send me a card. <laughs> Pretty please, will you send me something? <laughs> So what are you giving away? As a I, I told them it was going to be a surprise. So they're doing this on blind faith. Wow. Oh they have no idea what they're getting. Well, can you tell us? No way, Jose. <laughs> <laughs> nice oh, We won't tell anybody. Half the people here are in my group. Put the pattern <laughs> boxes. <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> Hi, Lori. Welcome. Lori loves Montana. She was. She and Holly were were going at it in my stream last night. It was so funny. Holly wouldn't let Lori have a cookie or something. I never did figure it all out. I'm just drawing paint again, Mary. You can switch me off to somebody oh. else. <laughs> well, let's go to Shannon. Looks like she's got an interesting face going there. Look at that. Um, I'm still making pages for my little watch faces. But they're getting bigger. Are they getting bigger? Isn't that a, that that lady is she on, on your left hand side? Is that going or is it your right hand? No, it's left hand. Is is she going to be a watch face? This one? The one the red haired lady with the short hair. That Vicky on right now. That's not me. Hey, Vicky. Vicky. <laughs> oh, I thought that was Shannon. Vicky, what are you going to do? I thought that was Shannon. I thought she was. Sorry, Shannon. <laughs> that's a, no, that's okay. <laughs> that's Vicky. Are you going to paint that face? What are you going to do, Vicky? No. I didn't hear Wait a minute. I'm just hearing Rosemary Driver. <laughs> 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 Hi, Linda. Linda Morrill, M O R R I L, says hi to everybody. And Chris, Chris Stina Bert Smith says hi from Colorado. Most people are. 
Oh, that's so funny. It was H I. <laughs> it was hello, Rosemary. Oh, sorry. My mistake. <laughs> Okay, Vicki, I want to know what you're going to do with that face. Are you going to draw it? It looks like yeah. it is. Yes, ma'am. Okay. With a dry colored pencil. Oh, with colored pencil. All right. One minute. Vicki is such a talent with faces. Just blows my mind. Just blows my mind. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Let's go watch Shannon. We'll come back, Vicki, and see your progress. Okay. Shannon's doing watches. Okay, there's a face. <laughs> I yeah, thought with me. that big face belonged to Shannon. Sorry. I love how she's putting them in the watches there. Shannon, can you scoot in? Down? Focus? Oh. Uh, it's super tiny. Yes. <laughs> you mean zoom in? Yeah, that's the word. Zoom. Okay. Zoom in. Like so. Uh, when it catches yes. up. Yes. Better. Yep. It's better. Um, can you move your watch up just about an inch, maybe? There. That's good. You want me to stand on one foot and yes, tongue yeah. tongue you know that you can yeah. do it, Shannon. <laughs> <laughs> Shannon, when's your next big show? Is that coming up in the um, July, or are you going in fall? I don't know. There's one coming up in July that um, I haven't actually committed to yet. Mm -hmm. So, don't know if we'll do that one or not. Um, yeah, don't know. On the fence. We're listening. Um, I had a lady contact me the other day. She was, she was with some kind of advertising company. And one of her clients had some used banners. And she asked if I could make tote bags out of them. Oh. And I said, why, yeah. <laughs> so um she has a meeting with a client on wednesday and they have six really big banners i can probably get about 36 tote bags out of one wow six so that would be a huge job but i'm kind of keeping my fingers crossed that that works out wow well we'll then, in you won't see me for like a month because i'll be sewing bags wow that's neat. Yeah. So that's your next big project, possibly. So well, that's a possibility. I'll know more probably after Wednesday. Yeah. Okay. We'll and is happens. uh is Jason working now? Did I I kind of get yeah. that one? Yeah. He, he's working full time now. He is. He's working for a company here that is in Fayetteville that is a machine shop. And he's doing um, purchasing, like, you know, he's always done supply chain. So that's what he knows. Cool. And what they do is they do work almost exclusively for the aerospace industry and the government and the military. Wow. Like, they machine parts for the International Space Station. Wow. So, you know, and especially if you're a guy, that's super exciting because, you know, he'll go out there and they'll show him a picture of the space station online and say, see, wow. see this, this is one of our parts. Wow. So, yeah, they do all kinds of cool stuff. Um, and it's kind of, it's one of those where, like, he can't even take his cell phone to work because of wow. security. Yeah, so I can't, like, I've, I know the building where he works, but I, I've never been inside. I don't have clearance. Super secret stuff, huh? Yeah, so he's probably actually a spy. <laughs> this is what I tell myself. He's like with the CIA. <laughs> and, um, yeah, the whole machine shop thing is just his little cover story. Wow. <laughs> well, at least he's on our side, right? Right. Yeah. <laughs> well, we think. <laughs> <laughs> 
could be a smart watch, Linda says. <laughs> yeah. But he really loves it there. I'm I'm really glad. Studio B Creations from Spartanburg, South Carolina. Welcome, welcome. Hello, hello. Who else is in here that I've been missing? Linda's Morrell Morrell and Christina. Uh, I have a hard time with names, but Amy's Colorful Creations is here. Christina Smith. Oh, I mentioned her before. She's one who's from Colorado. Uh, Hi, Wynn. She was high from Colorado. <laughs> yeah, remember, Rosemary remembers. Now, you guys, be good. <laughs> hey, we're not cussing. Remember, there was the cusser in the group here. That's right. That's right. <laughs> but that was before we went live. <laughs> That's because yeah, my no, internet was good and mean. Yeah, y'all don't know this, but Mary. Why would you even know God, last night when I went to bed and when I woke up this morning, it was down. <laughs> and I didn't do a thing to it. I think somebody was listening in and said, Mary's going to do a hangout tomorrow. Let's, let's, let's delay let's, her. Let's mess with her. Yes. Aunt Beck is back. Hi, Aunt Beck. Oh, dear. Was she gone? <laughs> yeah. no, we, love we love Aunt Beth. We love Aunt so confused. Some people yeah. say they're leaving and don't, so they can say I'm back, and everybody goes, <laughs> Oh, hi. <laughs> <laughs> well, Aunt Beth and Scott are painting the house. They they go down and they're getting their house ready to sell, oh. and so she. She's doing a paint job of a different kind this weekend. Girl. It's really hot down there where she is. It says the heat. She's saying that the heat is really bad down there in South Carolina. Mm. Oh, she was out cutting bushes today. Yeah, and Beth was out cutting bushes. I don't cut the bushes. I leave them for my brother. But I did mow the lawn. And it frustrates me so much. Every time, you know, you mow the lawn, you get it all pretty and it rains that night. And then the next night it rained again. If it rains tonight, I quit. And then it grows again. Yes. It grows up again. And it's just, it's totally frustrating. Isn't that odd how that happens? It is <laughs> odd. I mean, it's like, who controls this weather anyway? <laughs> oh, oh no. Whoever controls the weather must control the ethernet. I had one of those little... I've got to dig it out. One of those little inky things rolled off the top of my desk. Oh, there it is. We don't want ink on the floor or I'll get in big trouble. So continue on, ladies, while I hunt for... <laughs> Let me see where it went off to. Where did it go off to? I think I'm safe. Oh, there it is. I think I'm safe. <sighs> I don't know where that is my ruler now. I've lost my ruler and my stamp in two feet of space. So wherever my stamp is off to, my ruler's with it. <laughs> Vicki, how are you doing on that face? I'm doing pretty good. I think you Let's can see it. Let's go back over to Vicki. I'm going to put my eyes on first. That's probably why I'm losing everything. I don't have my glasses on. All right. Let's go over to Vicki. Oops, that's me. There you go. Oh, wow. Look at that. Oh, that's cool, Vicki. Hey, yeah, Laura. That um, color pencil may work out pretty good. Yeah. What um, are those? What brand of color pencil are you using? Everything. I've got this. I'm sketching in with illuminance, um, but I've got some. Um, Polychromos too. 
and some Prisma colors. Prisma colors. Is that what you're using now? No, right now I've got a around gosh. Oh, they're good ones. Of course. You use the good stuff. <laughs> yeah, I do. Well, that frustrates me. Huh. Well, if I quit looking for it, they'll show up. We're going to watch you for a little bit, Vicki. Okay. <laughs> I'm pulling apart ink pens, so I'm not doing anything exciting, getting my fingers black. This one plus gear pens come apart really easy. They're the Walmart brand, but boy, those Sharpies, they're hard to get apart. Now I've got some Sharpies I need to take apart. And I figure if I put 50 of these ink pens in this half a bottle of alcohol, that I'll have some black ink that will last me forever. I was thinking I would pour it into a sprayer then and spray through stencils and make a black and white journal. Aunt Beck says, we hide the things we use the most often. Don't, isn't that the truth? Isn't that the truth? The things that we really need are the things we lose. <laughs> like, I have no idea what happened to that kitty cat stamp, and I had it here. I wonder if it fell in my waste basket. No. It was here, and now it's gone. Meow. <laughs> meow. Uh, oh, there it is. Who's meowing? Rosemary. <laughs> Rosemary, are you meowing? <laughs> that kid that took off for Arkansas? <laughs> you have dogs, don't you, Rosemary? Yep. And I heard you say no more dogs? <laughs> oh, I told my husband that him and his second wife can get as many dogs as they want. <laughs> <laughs> um, and what did he say to that? Uh, what kind can I get? <laughs> <laughs> and how soon can I get them? How soon can I get it? <laughs> See, Shannon, knows, Shannon knows my husband. <laughs> they met. So do I. I'll bet he and Jason just really whoop it up. When they they never met. met. <laughs> <laughs> But mine did. I'm selective. Oh yeah, Vicky's met my husband. Vicky's <laughs> husband has met my husband. I fell in love. I think they're like engaged or something. I forget <laughs> <laughs> what happens, but I didn't want to know I anything. One of them could talk about. Okay. Nina says she just got back from doing the laundry. She hopes she didn't miss anything. Not a thing. Yeah, I'm pretty sure she did it. Oh, Jersey City's in the house. She says, Hi, what Jersey. Hey, Jersey. Let me switch over to Rosemary. She wants to know what Rosemary's working on. Let's oh, go dear. Oh, cool, Rosemary. Yeah, well, she's seen this a hundred times. You missed all of my stamping, though. This is what I did, Laura. Oh, we're, here's my, oh, well, that, no. You missed all my stamping. That's all I can say. Oh, those are all cleanups. Where are my real stamps? I lost, oh, there's one. No, that's a cleanup, too. Oh, this I like that one. This is what I've been doing. Cleaning up. Stamping. Woohoo! This one's pretty. Laura, you're next for a hangout. We've got to get together with Laura. 
Jersey. I know. I, I told her that's why I'm trying to figure out how to do this from my end because I want to. Well, do that that's what we're going to do then. You pick a time, Rosemary. You pick a time that's not Friday night. No, I'm, I'm not going to learn online, girl. Because you have to learn online. No, you, no. Learn. No you can learn a little no. offline, but you have to be the host. Well, I know. It's not you hard. Can privately i just need to learn how to hook up everything that's all well you're already hooked up all you have to do is, is uh go to your youtube we'll we'll take you through it that's you what i mean time and we'll take you through it and we'll okay. invite jersey and okay. we'll put a test like everybody else had to go through a test oh we'll i hate it. school <laughs> <laughs> you pick a time and let us know okay will do it's just, just, when, just when YouTube is discontinuing Hangouts, I'm going to learn. Yeah, that sounds really smart. That's <laughs> the easy way to learn is just to jump in. Why do I want to learn now? They're going to discontinue them. So what's the well, point? Well, look at your screen. If you look at your screen, the only thing that the, that the host has that's really any different is we can mute people. and Oh, I like their, that. Yeah, we can block them and control their video. And then we can control who's... You know who's in the spotlight that's really about the only difference from the controls that you see right now no i just don't know I just don't go from youtube no that to me is not it, that's not what i want to know that's not my problem i don't know how to connect the um the um, google hangout to my youtube i can well, that's I've, I've, done, I've done google hangouts just with friends but not yeah. on yeah, no, that's I'm that's easy. easy. That's really okay. easy. We'll we'll talk you through it. We'll talk you through it. Um, yeah, well, it's not hard. And once you get the what I'm kind of concerned about is that you don't have Ethernet, and uh, she does have the Ethernet. Wi-Fi might be strong enough to handle it. She does have Ethernet. Do you have Ethernet, Rosemary? Yeah. Oh, I thought you didn't have Ethernet. Who didn't have Ethernet, did I ask? Um, I was. I don't. Maybe that's why, because I said I was on Wi-Fi. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, if you have Ethernet, that's even better. If you're on Ethernet, that's even better because it's a, a stronger connection. Yeah. So, all right. Well, pick a time, Rosemary, you and Jersey, and, and we'll do a test. Okie dokie. You're locked in now, girl. Yep, you're locked oh. in. We'll we'll pick the time and well. And the, the problem what's going to be with me and Laura is that um we we're up at the opposite time of the day. Uh -oh. <laughs> so, <laughs> so we're probably going to have to hit like noon. <laughs> she's an early bird. I mean, she's getting up maybe a few hours after I'm going to bed. So you know, well. It's amazing we hook up at all, but we do. Uh, Susan, when we do a hangout like this, the host can invite up to 10 people. Like if you get too many people in here, like we got four now and it's going pretty good. But if you get too many people in, it kind of slows things down. The way I understand, I've never had 10 people in. But you guys can join on YouTube and watch on YouTube at any, at any time. I mean, that we're live. We're connecting. YouTube is using Google Hangouts is what's happening. And, Rosemary, it's not hard to connect the YouTube up to Google. You, you basically go to your video manager and go to your, um, to your streaming. Uh -huh. and you, look for, you look for events. And it'll open up a window, and you put in a title of your event. You have to do that, or it'll give you an error. And mm -hmm. then you say, start live. Mm -hmm. And then when you start live, it'll start a Google Hangout. She's not listening. Rosemary? <laughs> yes? Are you listening? <laughs> I'm listening, but it means absolutely nothing unless I'm actually okay. doing it. <laughs> okay. That's all abstract to me until yeah. I'm actually doing it. Okay. Well, that's okay. Uh, it's just, it's easy. Once you do well, it, I'm, once you go. I'm confident in you. You're a good teacher. I know once we get in there, it'll be easy. Yeah. 
And I know where you are because that's how I was. When, it was actually um, Linda McAllister who did, who uh, taught me the first uh, first, and then Jerry uh, sat down sat down and had a session with me. And Tanya, Tanya, and Mark. Um, you know, Mark the Potato Man, and uh, and Lisa, and we had a we had a chat. So, you know, it's not hard once you get in there. You'll say, "Oh, what did I worry about?" Yeah. <laughs> it's easy, Linda says. And Linda, Linda, I got a message saying that Google was Hangouts are going to go away later this year. When I opened up my Google Hangout, I got that message. That's the first time I've seen that message. So I hope that they replace it with like the meetup or whatever that they have. I hope they just don't take it away from us, period. Um, what is that, um, that thing that you guys use, Mary, when you're doing those classes on Zoom? Zoom. Oh yeah, Zoom. Yeah. But that doesn't hook up to YouTube. You no. have to record. Right. You have to record if you want to. And and they have to. If people want to participate, they have to join. I and the that, biggest problem that I see to that is it's hard to communicate. Like we were communicating through email, and and not everybody. You know, it goes to spam and all of that. Mm -hmm. Um. So, I actually like the Google Hangout in that we can go live like now and everybody can just pop in and watch mm -hmm. us. And I like that about Google Hangout. I hope that they don't, I hope that they replace it with something. Exactly. I can't imagine them just dropping it. Laura wants to know who Mark the Potato Man is, and so do Mark I. Muir. Mark Muir, M U I R. Susan said, Mark Muir. He's always saying potatoes. Everything like he'll say, he'll say potatoes for everything. <laughs> he likes potatoes. <laughs> like he asked me to carve him a potato stamp, and I haven't got to it yet. <laughs> oh, okay. He's kind of a goofy goofball, you know. <laughs> He's a nice guy. He does mark um, art art explorations. Like instead of exploration, it's like art. Yeah. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah. Rosemary, is that still the joint tape or whatever is it called? Mina wants to know what you're using, Rosemary. Oh, now I'm using carpet tape. Before, when I was doing the jelly plate, that was um, drywall joint tape, which is a tape that has no adhesive. It's just called joint tape. Now I'm using real tape just to confuse everybody, that really does have adhesive. <laughs> <laughs> and and I, I've got some, um, I have a bunch of, uh, well, those people that, that follow me, they know I make a bunch of uh, um, fabric kits and I'm working on one right now that's African with my African fabrics. And so I'm just making this washi tape with my scraps to include in the kit. So that's what I'm doing right now. Cool. Very cool. She's doing something very productive. Yeah, gluing. Gluing. <laughs> <laughs> but you're gluing for a kit. Yeah. So you go to Rosemary's Etsy shop and you'll see that kit in a bit. <laughs> in a bit. Oh, she's a poet. Kit in a bit. Hottie Popo's in the house. Oh, no, Miss Hottie. Hello. She says, trouble in all the one place. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Hottie. I thought you liked me. Uh, <laughs> Hottie tells the truth. That can't argue with that. Mina said, thank you, Rosemary. The next trip to the hardware store, I'm going to get carpet tape. I got mine at Menards, and it's all Rosemary's fault. Yeah, but don't be fooled now. Car all carpet tape is not is not really sticky, so don't get disappointed. And I don't know one brand for another because these particular ones 
I got on um, on Amazon and I got two different kinds and one is stickier than the other. So what kind should we not get? I what? don't, there's so many brands out there. I don't know. You know, there oh. might be a stronger one than I've got. You know what I'm saying? So I don't want to say don't get this and do get this. Yeah. Although I will tell you, okay. I originally got this tape. It's called ATAC. And I got that on Amazon. All right. I got so excited. I used the whole thing. And because I just, you know, I got kind of addicted. Use ended up using the whole roll of how many feet? Oh, 30 yards in two nights. I did the whole wow. thing. <laughs> and I needed some more. So of course you had to go to Amazon because oh, I went to Home Depot. I, I went to all the places would have carpet tape. They did not have this brand. So I go, oh man, what am I gonna do? So I went back to Amazon again and I saw this tape. It's called X Fasten. And so I got this tape. Well, this <laughs> tape compared to this tape, even though this is very sticky, compared to this one, it's not as sticky. So I'm using this one because it still works. Huh. But given the choice, I would not buy this again and I would buy the ATAC. So after I bought this, I went back to check and voila, ATAC was back. Oh, no. <laughs> so I had to buy several rolls because I don't want to <laughs> use x Fasten again. So, <laughs> so now that you're totally confused. <laughs> now, it, I don't, I'm not usually one that will tell you, you know, get the expensive one. But it turned out that this one is better. It was only maybe about four dollars more, but still, you know, paying sixteen dollars when you could buy twelve dollars, but it makes a difference when it comes to this carpet tape. So the only difference I saw on the explanation is that technically this is not called carpet tape. All right. Everybody is buying carpet tape, but the one that came out being the best doesn't say carpet tape anywhere. So maybe that's the difference. Maybe huh. that's the difference. Huh. Um, it's just called double-sided tape. Huh. Highly, high strength double tape. So anyway, if that, you know, if you guys do Amazon and you don't mind waiting a day or two, ATAC is the one to get. Good to know. Yeah. I got, I went to Monards and got the duck brand, which is probably... I think I paid about, what, $10 for, I don't know how many yards of it. Uh -huh. It works. I made the washi tape. Mm -hmm. Because of you, Rosemary, it's all your fault. <laughs> <laughs> Only blame me if it works. <laughs> yeah, it worked. It worked. Okay. It worked great. Okay, good. Now, I, I've never heard of the APAC and X fast, fast or whatever that is. Me neither. Never heard of them. But it's probably a lot cheaper than the duck than the brand name like duck tape, you know. Well, this one was sixteen dollars. Oh, this well, then, one and that one has thirty what? yards, and it was sixteen. Yeah. This one also has thirty yards, and it was like twelve dollars. Huh. And so the adhesive did make the price did make a difference on that particular item. Huh. That's not That's always a lot true. Tape. Huh? That's a lot for tape. Yeah. Well, it's double sided though. It's two inches for 30 yeah. yards. Yeah. Um, you can find just regular old carpet tape. I know a lot of people are just using regular carpet tape. I don't know if it's going to stick to the things they're putting it on. I mean, I know the fabric will stick to it. But like, for instance, I made a journal. I think it's already gone. I think I already stole it. But I did made a journal. And what I did is I um, put this on the binding on the back. Now, that's going to take a lot of abuse. Now, I wouldn't do that with this tape, but I'll do it with this tape. It did not come off. It didn't lift or pucker or anything. Um, so it was worth it. Yeah, so it's worth it for what I use it for. But if you're just going to cut a piece and glue it on a page, I don't think it really matters what brand you use because you're not going to be you know, testing the strength that's just going to sit yeah. on a page. Yeah. Or if you use it as a tab, I don't think it'll, that won't 
you know, matter either. So like anything, you know, it's what you're going to use it for. And you're using the good stuff because you're making a kit, right? Well, this is the medium one. This is the medium oh, one the medium. because they're not going to be putting it on, on the binding of their journals. Probably yeah. they're going to put, they're going to make a pocket. I show them different ways how to use it, you know, so in case they don't Very know what to cool. do with it. Yeah. Very cool. Ew. My fingers are black. Uh-oh. I've got four more pins to do. I keep finding pins. <laughs> I'm going to see how dark this black can get with all of these. Oh, see, now see Laura. She, she's only spent $8 on hers. Her carpet tape. And she says oh. it's working out just fine. From Lowe's. Eight bucks a roll. Yep. Yep. We don't have a Lowe's. We have a Menards. Probably simple. I mean, same stuff. I'm Jace Madison. Do you remember what brand it is? You asking me? No, I'm asking Laura. Okay. Hey, Biddleson's in the house, too. They're all coming out of the woodwork. Out of the woodwork. <laughs> Yay. They know a good thing when they see it. Rosemary, Shannon, and Vicki. That's right. <laughs> and Mary. Well, Mary's just Mary's just in the background. Hey, but it's your channel. They found you. I know. Thank you guys for coming. I really appreciate it. Thank you for inviting. I want to do this again. I was chicken to invite you, Shannon. <laughs> uh, it needs thank somebody you for inviting me to Vicky. <laughs> cluck, cluck. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Have to thank Vicky. Thank you, Vicky. <laughs> Thank you, Vicki. You're welcome. <laughs> I'm going. Shannon, Shannon is, is too busy for Mary. She's making her custom keepers. You never know until you ask. I know. Yeah. I don't take rejection very well, Shannon. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> I got a sensitive nature. <laughs> now, I was just, I was really, uh, I asked Vicki, who do you think that we should ask? And she said, either Shannon or Rosemary. So she went ahead and asked, and, well, yay. <laughs> what happens when you ask? Uh, don't ask if you don't, if you don't want us to say yes. <laughs> <laughs> Well, now I'll be asking all the time. <laughs> ah. ah. No. We need to get Jersey, and we're going to have Rosemary host so that she can learn how to host. So you pick a time, Rosemary, okay. and you I'll let us know. With Laura. Yeah. And let me know. Yep. Don't make it on a Friday night, though. <laughs> okay. But you, you can do it at 4.30 in the morning if you want. Yeah, you and your dreams. <laughs> I'm just Don't getting... your dogs get you up at night? See you in one of my early morning lives because your dogs woke you up? I think so. Uh, it might have. I don't know. They rarely... I asked you what you were doing up, and you said the dogs woke you up. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, but I remember it because she was half asleep. <laughs> they, they rarely wake me. The only time they wake me up is if there's a really bad storm and my my little guy he'll oh. come over and he'll just he's so cute he oh. he's not, he's not a barker he's not a jumper he doesn't get on the bed he doesn't do anything it'll come over to the side of the bed and he gets his little paw oh. and he puts it on my shoulder just oh. enough for me to wake up and i'll open my eyes and he's looking at me like get me out of this storm <laughs> <laughs> I'm ready to get under the bed. Help me out. <laughs> Poor little fella. Yeah. Aunt Beck showed her little Bernadette on their trip to down to Columbia the day. Now they had beach traffic. They were caught in traffic. Everybody was going to the beach or was miles oh, of wow. miles and miles of backup for the beach. 
Well, we don't have that problem here in Arkansas. Yeah, that's what I said. We don't have beaches in Nebraska. <laughs> our, our, our only backup is if the hogs are playing in Fayetteville. Well, Tara, you should try living uh, about a mile from that. <laughs> No, thank you. Yeah. Where was that, Shannon? We live just right down the road from the university. Oh. So, yeah, when the Razorbacks play, we can't leave our house because <laughs> of the traffic. Was that Shannon or Vicki talking? I'm washing my hands. Oh, Shannon. No. Vicki lives up in Bentonville. She lives in uh, Walmart's backyard. Yeah. yeah. Walmart's backyard. She lives up there with all the rich people. Yeah, oh. I was one once. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you know, actually, um, Lynn gifted me a gift certificate to Walmart. And I was surprised at the things that you could order online that you can't get off of the shelf. Like, I got a Tim Holtz stamp. Well, they're, like, they're like everybody else. They, they um, in between sell guys. from yeah. other companies. Yeah, just for but their mail. That's okay them. with me because all I had to do was go pick it up. Right. <laughs> and that was cool. I, you know, I didn't expect that out of them. So I actually got I got a B stencil and uh, that Tim Holtz stamp, and then they had um, the Windsor Newton Cottam and the they had that on sale. So I like that when I go urban sketching. And I got one of those. Ooh. Maybe I'll pour this into a spray bottle and see how it sprays now. Let's go to Vicki and see how her face is coming. Oh, wow. Just look at that. Oh, that is so cool, Vicki. You are so talented. Oh, uh, look at her go. Yeah, uh, y'all got me working, and she makes me sick. <laughs> you, put, you put us really good artists to shame. Your resume better be nice, or I won't. I won't figure <laughs> out her computer request. Oh yeah, that's right. I got to kiss up. I forgot. Yeah. <laughs> oh, 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 Vicky, that's so pretty. Oh. It is though. It is. <laughs> I mean, I I I mean it when I say it. <laughs> I don't think it's kissing up. I think it's cool. <laughs> it comes from the heart, Vicky. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Boy, that was enthusiastic. <laughs> I'm in the zone. <laughs> I need to vacuum this rug. I spilled little shards of paper all over the place <sighs> all right i'm going to pour some of my alcohol ink in a spray bottle and see see how strong it is vicky that is so cool mm -hmm. so cool you are doing an excellent job now i'm kissing up <laughs> <laughs> it works and then after we get Rosemary going, we've got to get Vicki going so that she can host some lives. And Shannon's so smart, we, you know, she'll figure it all out. <laughs> yeah, y'all just tell me where to show up. I'll come to yours. Yeah. <laughs> Shannon, of course, I know Shannon has the, you know, she's running a business, so she's got time issues. But, boy, Shannon, you do some live streams and some hangouts and, and uh, you'd get a good crowd, I'll tell you. We well, don't come. I'm just amazed that anybody shows up ever. So <laughs> <laughs> that's all good. Yeah. You know better. I don't know what happened to my little stuff. I'm frustrated. Hmm. Okay, so I've got my ink in a spray bottle. Now I think I need to get this pencil and some papers. Mm. 
my stamp just disappeared on me. I'm just amazed that it just it just disappeared. Meow. <laughs> I hear it meowing. <laughs> I wonder if I closed it up in a journal. Did I do that? I don't see it. I hear some purring. There it is. <laughs> no, not for real. <laughs> Okay, well, we'll just keep playing with the ink then. You have any catnip? Nope. Oh, well. That's probably where it went, someplace where it could get good catnip. Let's see what's going on in chat. Stardy Nama's here. And Susan Gerald says, when your art gets too businessy, it's not fun anymore. Then what do you do for fun? Oh, Shannon does a lot of stuff for fun. <laughs> um, some of that fun would be what you're looking at right now. Yeah, you come to hangouts. <laughs> uh, let's see. Starving uh -huh. Women says that would be a good journal cat cover. Vicki just got fantastic drawing. Yeah, Vicki does beautiful work. Just beautiful. Oh, thank you. And how long? You've been working on that less than an hour, haven't you? Yeah, an hour and um, 18 years of practice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> years. I yeah. forgot about the 18-year part. but. <laughs> and how much money? Uh, a lot. All of it. <laughs> I probably have ten, fifteen thousand dollars $15,000 worth of soft pastels here mm -hmm. i got to play with them <laughs> some of them the soft the pan pastels i'm special yes you, you are, are special she i let agree me, she let me mix it up and everything my problem was that i like everything so i would pick up a new medium and you got to have all the stuff to go with it. That's right. Yeah, but you share. That's the good part. That's fun. There's a <laughs> lot of people that don't want to play and share. <laughs> Nobody has said who this is yet. Y'all don't recognize it? The what? Yes, I do. Hi. I miss my red hair. You can get it back. Yeah, but it's too much trouble with the white. The oh, red. that's true. You could go blonde. Uh, no. Or red. <laughs> no. No. The red is what I liked. Yep. Well, it matches your personality. <laughs> you got that spunky personality. Yeah, I know. That's funky. <laughs> but funky stuff that gets me in so much trouble. <laughs> Not so much anymore, though. I've I've been I've had my wings clipped. You had your wings clipped? Oh, I found my other postcards, though. My bird postcards. I couldn't find those. See, that's that's what what that is. Is. the birds. Yeah, if I just keep looking for stuff, they show up eventually. Because I'm looking for something else, and there they were. There's another project I need to finish. I'm looking for some more stencils to put down on here. Oh, here, we go. put this one down. I want to test out my black ink. Yeah, I think I'll try that plaid. Oh dear, you don't want to see behind me. <sighs> Jersey says I love me some Shannon Green. Oh, thank you. <laughs> so loved. Uh, let's, let's pop on to Shannon. Let's see what she's up to. 
Oh, what are you doing, Shannon? Ooh, that's cool. I'm just, I don't know. I put <laughs> some paint on some paper and then I might put this and then trace it and maybe black so it pops. Wow. But I might want to put a rubber stamp down. So that yeah. is cool. Like it wasn't popping already. Yeah, like it's <laughs> not already popping. That's the first time I've had that problem, have a lead break. Of course, I am on uh, burlap. You, Vicki, is that you talking? Yeah. You're you're doing that on burlap? Yeah. Wow. You just amazed me. That's uh, impressive. Impressive. I put a piece of that sheer stuff over it. But it's not changing the grain a whole lot. All right, let's see how this black spray sprays. I figure I need to get it really black for it to be black enough. Let's close my book over it. Let's just take this. It's a messy job, but somebody's got to do it. Right? That's a spirit. <laughs> Ooh, I like it, though. Let's see what it looks like on the other side. Ooh, little oh, that didn't go so great huh all righty we'll buy that one more page one more let me just put some sprays through here mm -hmm. And it's got all those bright colors that Vicky muted out. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yep. That's what my brother says. I'll say something and he'll say, yep. <laughs> <laughs> Sounded just like him, Shannon. <laughs> yep. Sorry, but you did. <laughs> I was channeling him. You channeling him. He went to um, uh, on the weekends that they have him over. He goes up to visit his granddaughter and his son. Was they man get away from the wind chimes. Wind chimes. Yeah, that must be Rosemary. Yeah. Rosemary, your wind chimes are chiming. Because she walked into them. Oh, she walked in the middle of the middle of the freaking room. <laughs> <laughs> I like wind chimes. Vicky has issues with Rosemary's wind chimes. Well, just because I hit them every time I. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when you live in a city, your neighbors don't always appreciate the wind chimes. <gasps> They never bothered me. I always liked to hear them. Well, I guess I'm okay with it. My hands are black, but I'm okay with it. I've got to do something in my journals. Did anybody see? Oh, wait. I'm wrong. I got it. I got it. I got it. Ha. <laughs> She's back in. What happened? Oh. I thought I lost my ink pad, but it was oh. temporarily missing. It was under your nose. <laughs> it was hiding. 
All right, I'm going to take these sprays and put them away. That's part of my problem. I get stuff out to use it, and it sits out. And then I move it someplace. I never really, I, I need to learn to put my stuff back where I can find it. I try. That wouldn't be fun. That, yeah, that would, that would help, wouldn't it? I still don't know what I did with that stamp. Huh. Well, hmm. I'm trying to find my papers that I did my alcohol inks on. I can't find them. Your alcohol inks? Yeah, the ones that I did when um, Vicky oh. was here. And when uh, Vicky came over? Yeah, I found my pan pastel ones, but I can't find my. I must have. You want to see them? I don't know where I put them. If I had a whole house like you, Rosemary, I'd never find anything. I mean, <laughs> I know. Where is that one in? It's sad but true. Surprisingly organized. I'll bet she is. Well, I'm not now. I can't find that one thing. <laughs> Usually, I like to pride myself in that. If, if you know people come over and they're playing and they go, "Do you have blah blah blah?" I go, "Yep," and I come up right to it and find it. But, she's just irritating that way. But just don't <laughs> ask me where your papers are. You just did the other day. I think the mistake was I actually probably put them away, and I'm trying to remember where I put them away to. What category in my mind? What category were they in? <laughs> what category were they no, in? Category. <laughs> where would I put those? So did any of you hit the Hobby Lobby sales that were going on this weekend? I did yesterday and didn't find a blooming thing. No. You didn't? Oh, my. What wow. were you looking for? Anything. <laughs> Anything. Well, you know, sometimes those stores don't coordinate, you know, they're... I got these little uh, airbrush bottles once let me get here i have them and i'm so disappointed i'm going to go off on me these little airbrush bottle things they work really nice as fine liners like this and i found a package of six of them and i wanted to test them out and i really like them and i've gone back to hobby lobby twice now and they're not there anymore and i'm so disappointed oh you can order them <laughs> yeah i should probably try to order them <sighs> <laughs> I will. I did my Walmart order this this month though from Lynn's gift. I have to wait till next month. <laughs> well, I went to the Hobby Lobby here in my town. And did you find anything? They had the six by six um gel printing plate. I got on Mary. Hmm? You're on. Oh, okay. I I got the uh, six by six gel printing plate. All right. Cool. By Speedball. Oh, yeah. five by five, not a six by six. Five by five. Yeah. And it's regular. I forget what the regular is. Like sixteen bucks or eighteen. I don't know what it was there. It was kind of expensive, but they had it down for three ninety nine. Wow. Oh, wow. So when I went up to visit Shannon, like she mentioned, they have a Hobby Lobby in her parking lot. So I went over there and uh, they had this in the speedball section, obviously it's by speedball. So I go over there and there weren't any. So I go, oh, well, you know, they sold them all. Because so I'm the last one. So then I go over to <laughs> the other area and looking at other stuff. And I went over to the section where they have Tim Holtz stuff. By Tim Holtz, they had three of these, but it was still the regular price. So I go over to the manager and I said, um, over in my store, these were, you know, three, whatever it cost. I said, are these going to be marked down? And if so, can you mark it down for me? So he goes, where was the one that you found at your store? I said, over at the speedball um, display. So he walks me over to the speedball display, which I had just come from there, and I knew there wasn't any there. 
And so he looks up there and there was the rack and it showed the, you know, that that's, this should have been there and it was empty. And then he goes, oh, well, um, they're already all sold. And I'm thinking, I've got two in my stinking hand right now. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think they're all sold, you know. Oh. And I said, um, uh, you know, like, I, wasn't, I didn't want to be rude to him. But I'm thinking, like, hello. <laughs> I'm right here. Oh. And, um, and he says, oh, now listen, this is total corporate. All right. He says, those that you have in your hand sell over in the craft department. The ones over here that were on sale are in the fine art department. Oh, we're, clear, we're clearing them out in the fine art, and now they're going to be over in the craft. So, corporate, so me. corporate says, cut $10 off instead of someone picking them up and taking them over to the craft area. No, they have to mark them down and sell them. So that now they're in the craft instead of the fine art. Does any wow. of that make sense? Isn't that interesting? Wow. So, so I should have lied. Here. I should have lied to him and said, "Oh no, no, no! It was there in the speedball section. Yeah. You forgot yeah. to mark it down." <laughs> what were they doing selling them in the craft area? That would be my question. <laughs> well, you know, just like they do, the jelly plate would be in a craft department, right? You know, so. Anyway, that's that's where they're selling them now, and so you won't find them in the speedball section. You know, you'll find them over in the other area. So anyway, that was my Hobby Lobby story. <laughs> and yes, Susan, Rose, uh, Rosemary got a uh, a gel plate at one of her Hobby Lobbies. She was yeah. asking if that was a speedball gel plate. Yeah, it is. Yep, she I got, got it at it. one Hobby Lobby, but not the I other got one. It. I got the last one, Rosemary. Oh, you did? <laughs> I thought you said you didn't find any. <laughs> oh, no, I got this one. Um, it's not worth $19, let me tell you. Yeah, well, it, I only uh, paid $3 for mine, $3.25. Look at the difference in the width. Oh, I know, I noticed that. But I figured for $3, you can't lose. Well, it wasn't $2, it was $4.99. Not the one I got. Well, you bitch. Well, <laughs> that's what you got for stealing. Anyway, look over here. I'm I'm showing you guys. Just to listen to Vicky right now. I'm showing you you guys the the prints I got from my pan pastels um, that she let me use. They were mine while I was using them. And so what I did is I took a stencil. <laughs> Put it on a clean jelly plate, which I don't think she has one, but I do. It was <laughs> clean. And so you put the stencil on it, and then you come with the pan pastels and fill in. And then come over, like she explained before, put the white paint over, pull it, and this is what you get. It's super cool. Can you do the ghost print from the pan pastel then? Is that that is the ghost print. That's this, the ghost print. This was the first print. It, I put too much white paint, so you didn't see the pan pastel too well. So oh. then I did a second one, and that's what that is. Wow. Yeah. So pretty cool. But I wish I could show you my my um my ink one. I can have one room. Oh no, I did. I know how you feel, Rosemary. I think it's off of the kitty cat. I think it ran away with my kitty cat. Yes, yep. I did. <coughs> my kitty cat thing just disappeared on me. It just, it's not here anymore. I looked on the floor. I looked behind my desk. I looked, in the I looked in the art journal to see if I folded it up in the art journal, but it, no. You know, sometimes I stamping in the art journal and I'll if you guys if you guys have a dollar tree in your area they have this book there right now oh i was just at dollar tree yesterday why didn't i see that well i have three dollar trees and only one of them had them so oh. um and then i was talking with sarah and i told her sarah i think they have these over there so, and she lives like about 10 miles, no, five miles from me in yeah. another town. So 
she went over to go look for them and they didn't have them in hers, but they had some other mixed media ones that I didn't have in mine. So I got her one of, of from over here and she got me one from over there. But she, the last time she came over, she forgot to bring it. <laughs> but, but she brought lunch. Wait, wait, wait. She brought lunch, so I did not care. Oh, so, lunch trumps everything. Lunch was better than getting the book. But yeah, yeah. so it's kind of cool. It's got some different things. I mean, some things are a little freaky, but, you know, lots of us like freaky stuff. But, um, but you know, for a dollar, hello. Heck. Can't beat it. Even if you just use it to glue other stuff into it, you know? Yep. I was at Shannon's store too. Say what? We don't, we don't have those stores in Benton County because Walmart. Oh, because Walmart. Well, we got Walmart here too. I mean, you know. Yeah, but this is home office. I, I don't know that we don't have it. I mean, I mean, Walmart is so bad down here. We don't have any grocery store except Walmart. You cannot. Mm -hmm. You can't go anywhere else. You have That's to go to Walmart. To and that really irritated me moving here. Because yeah. It's Kroger, like nobody's business. Yeah. It's either Walmart or Walmart. Or we do have Harps, but they're so expensive. Yeah. And you got Whole Foods up there in your area too, right? We've got Whole Foods. We yeah. Look, you guys, this is make a fun journal to make. Oh, Shannon, we were thinking of something to do. Hello, I've got the idea now. What? We want to hear it. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> Never Rosemary. mind. Rosemary, we what? want to see. No, it's being recorded. Ooh, look at that. <laughs> 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 I want to hear your idea. Being that I have to come up on the idea on myself, <laughs> all by myself, <laughs> I don't see why I should be sharing with anybody. You know, <laughs> you forgot you were you forgot that you were on a hangout, Rosemary. Oh, you you were yeah, well, you can't have what I shut up about that discussion, didn't you? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll give you the address and the time and the day and the cost, and you can show yeah. up at the class. <laughs> we'll give you an advanced time. You know, you have to travel, so. Yeah. <laughs> I'm still looking for my stamp. I'm for my, <laughs> my kitty cat stamp. Just... <laughs> the cat took it away. Yeah, something happened to it. It just disappeared on me. Oh, we have people leaving. Was it something I said? There was you. <laughs> Bye, Jeremy. Thank you for keeping us company. Well, you know, those gals on the East Coast, it's 6 o'clock there. They're probably getting hungry. Yeah. They're supper time. I'm waiting to hear my husband's stomach start growling. If you guys need to leave, you just you just let us know. Say goodbye before you leave. Don't just pop out on us. <laughs> they go, what did we say? Oh, look at this little cute thing. <laughs> A little transfer. That's cute. Well, cool. Well, anyway, it's a cute little book for a dollar. You can't, you know, you can't knock it. Oops, hurry, quick, quick, quick. Okay. I didn't find my stamp, but I found a chicken. There you go. Oh, I see, Shannon, we well, got a bunch of, well, you know, Tyson country. Maybe we should do some chickens. <laughs> We could dip <laughs> the chicken. Oh dear! I bet they would donate parts for us. <laughs> oh yuck! Now, what is that called? Where the the Japanese fish printing, where they actually use the actual fish? Oh, I forget what it's called right now. It Do we have fish? 
But yeah, you know what I'm talking about. Oh, should, I know what you're talking about. Yeah. Yeah. We should start doing that with chickens. It's like, you know, the southern, oh. the southern version of that Japanese. Food oh, food. my God. What are you guys talking about? Fish and chicken. No, well, there's a, there's a, on a, there's a form of printing and you use as a Japanese printing technique, but you use a fish. Oh, no. As your, you know, stamp. It's actually really cool. It is. To look at. Yeah. It's really cool. Yeah. That's There's this I lady. Think. I can't remember her name right now, but she does. Um, you use a chicken. Yeah. Well, that's that's her idea. <laughs> yeah, that's the southern version of the Japanese fish printing. You know. Yeah. What is that thing called? Hey, people are talking about food. In the chat, I'm getting upset. <laughs> They're talking about marinated chicken, baked potato, and green oh, beans. It's supper time. And then we got some pulled pork. Shut up, people. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> My mouth is starting to drool. <laughs> Oh, and an ice cream truck. Oh, my goodness. That's the whole kit and caboodle there. I think I'm done. I'm bored. Wait. <laughs> you better Vicky, move on. <laughs> Vicky is bored? Oh, yeah. yeah. try something new. Oh, um, Vicky. I'm kind of like a kid that gets bored in school. Oh, wow. Oh, look at that. Isn't that? That's awesome, Vicky. Thank you. So what are you going to do oh. next now that you're bored? Uh-oh, Tanya, Tanya's back. Watch out. Don't be talking about her no more. Hi, Tanya. <laughs> Everybody shut up. Oh, dear. Oh, Vicky, yeah. they're saying how beautiful it is. She did, that is just excellent, Vicky. Oh, I should look at chat. Yeah. Go look at, go look at what they're saying. And Beck said she's going to go watch and paint walls. <laughs> I'm so glad I don't have to do that. Thank you, guys. It's um, it's interesting to try to do realistic work on a strange background like burlap. I, I'll bet it is. Well, you made it work. Is that the one that has muslin on it, though? No, this is the one that has the... Uh, that real sheer silk screen type stuff, oh. chiffon. Wow. That one has chiffon. So I'll bet the texture of the burlap probably comes through. It does. That's what made it hard. Oh, you did a good job. Wow. Thank you. You know, I may have lied. That may be the muslin. Well, regardless, if the texture does. probably comes through. It does. That's what was... Yeah, this is Maslin. I like how you handled her hand because you, you detailed like the center part of her fingers, but the fingers closest to the face are not detailed and the fingers going down to her wrist, the, the, the reverse of the palm. Yeah. That detailed. And so, you know, you didn't try to define everything on that. And I think yeah. that was effective. I was having trouble getting the pencils to make a mark. Yeah, but it, it, it's really effective. It, it, well, good. It Thank like you. intentionally did that. <laughs> um, well, with my ADD, which I'm not formally diagnosed, but I'll diagnose two, you. Two to three hours is about all I can work on any one thing. Yeah. Well, that makes sense. And then I switch. Yep. So I'm going to do. We're listening. Hey, Debbie. Debbie's in the house. A little bit in my idea journal. Oh, an idea journal. Yeah, it's um. It's what I learned from Robin McClendon. Oops, just busted my camera. Ooh, there's some gold. Ooh, that's pretty. And it's just intuitive collaging and making your own papers. This is some 
paper I made at Rosemary's last summer. Ooh, cool. I try to do three or four pages in this a week. Theory You're being an idea journal that a client could look at this and go, ooh, I like that, but it's a little bit too bright. Or I like this. Your so journals are very textural. You have a lot of texture in your journals. Yeah. So it's all papers that I've made. Wow. Intuitive scripting. Very cool. Thank you. Those are awesome. Thank you. And I try to be muted and it's everyone's while something jumps in. So I could take one of these and make it bigger, like make it fireplace size. Oh, very good. Very, very that's not supposed to be stuck right there, but I moved it. I mean, I'm, I stapled it and it immediately came loose. This is what you get when you put alcohol ink on your, I mean, alcohol with your paint or your ink on a jelly plate. You oh. get some real neat effects. Interesting. Yeah. So, what we're going to do. We're listening. We're waiting. <laughs> there there was. Was. Waiting for me? Uh huh. <laughs> we want to hear what you're going to do next. Well, I'm going to put that down. Oh, you know what? I think we, I don't want to run in. Beth uh, Schuler goes live at uh, 7 o'clock, 6 o'clock her time, 6 o'clock Eastern. What is it 6 o'clock Eastern now? Is Beth live? Is Beth streaming? I don't want to uh, run into her stream. Yeah, we don't want to hog everything. No. Um, let's see. Let me go see. Beth, are you live yet? Let's see. Six oh. Eastern. Yeah, she would be live. Let's see, Beth Schuler. I think we should probably plan on ending this pretty soon so Beth can do her her uh, Saturday night bingo game. Uh oh, and look at supper. <laughs> so, um, I don't want to cut you all off, but I really want to thank you all for coming. Thank you. Thank you, thank you for having us. And thank you, everybody that came. Yeah. yeah. And I apologize about the Ethernet connection. Well, that got fixed real quick. Well, I try. Oh, Tony's going to check. Oh, there she is. What are you saying, Beth? Beth, we want you to go live. We don't want to hold you up. I wanted to be off of here before you went live. To 7 Eastern, so that's 6 our time. 6 our time? Okay. So we got 45 minutes. Right. So and just you know what we time. can do in 45 but, minutes. Yeah. <laughs> Hell, I could probably know. Don't, don't leave yet. We're not, we're just, um, I was thinking that she went on at 6 Eastern, but she goes on at 7 Eastern, and it's 6 my time. She says she loves bingo with Aunt, with Aunt Beth. <laughs> yeah, and she does those kitty cat tags. And oh, I'll be talking about kitty cats now. Yeah, if you aren't subscribed to Beth Schuler, scroll up to her icon there and and uh, and comment, like, share, and subscribe. <laughs> she does uh, her pick tens with bingo on Saturday night, and I really enjoy that. So we'll be on for a little bit longer, and then we'll we'll move along and let Beth have her time. 
So what are you doing? I interrupted you, Vicky. Oh, I'm, I use Uhu glue. You and that's why the pages are so flat. Oh, okay. So I put that on there. Now I'm just going to trim it. And if you use the back side of a ruler, an aluminum ruler, it's a whole lot easier than going out a cutting machine. Yeah, I like to tear with my metal ruler. Let's see what Shannon's up to. I am fixing to look for more heads to put in more watches. Oh, you're going to do more paper and watch? Oh, Shannon. Oh, that, oh, wow. Far out. That is so cool. I love it. It's bright and happy. Oh, yeah. Wow. It, it that did come out good. So, Shannon does beautiful work. She's going to do have pretty little phrases to go on some of these. Oh, And. I love his hair. Yeah, yeah. I need more heads. She needs more heads. <laughs> more heads. Uh. Oh, Humphrey Bogart. <laughs> oh, we. Oh, he needs to be in a manly watch. <laughs> I cannot believe that Shannon has all of her cutouts for magazines organized. <laughs> oh, no. No, no. <laughs> She's just showing me the ones that are organized. This is only a portion. Okay, Bill Murray. Needs to be in a watch. I don't need them cut out. There we go. Oh, this is Groundhog Day. Yeah. Favorite Bill Murray movie. No. What about Bob? I have people faces there, and then I have a folder full of people heads. These are typically larger than the people faces, but I've got some big watches, so <laughs> we'll see. Look at that. People's. He's looking for heads. Ooh. <laughs> looking for heads. These are all too big. Oh, there's Debbie Apps. Hi, Debbie. She says, try half price books. They have magazines for a dollar and under. Tanya says, Mary, can you check your messages while you're on? Yes, I can. I see your message, Tanya. Let me look. Oh, yes, absolutely. Tanya wants to. Tanya's going to stream tomorrow at 12 o'clock. Central time is when she normally streams, but she wants to tell you all what uh, she needs, what you need to bring tomorrow to her stream. So we go right ahead, Tanya. Thank you. You'll probably type it in. You're very welcome. Tanya does a totally junk junk journal. And I've missed the last few sessions. I just one thing after another, but I'm planning on being there tomorrow. Look at those heads. <laughs> I got heads. Wow.
Hi, Eva. I think these are going to work. There she goes. I'm going to tell them, Tanya, while while Shannon's sorting out her head. She says she <laughs> to change the plans. Oh, God. <laughs> Says, I had a change of plans, so want you all to have a large sheet of some kind of heavy paper, like a paper bag, a wallpaper, or a map, or a piece of scrap book paper will work. Is there anything else? Lisa says, headhunter. Do we need anything else, Tanya, other than strong paper? Oh, then some cereal box cardboard. So far, I'm okay. So strong paper and cardboard. And then just the normal stuff, like security envelopes and some kind of an adhesive. Um, your scissors and just what you junk journal with. Very cool. Thank you all for coming in here. Let's see. Serenity says, Shannon, I wish I had some of those magazine cutouts. <laughs> <laughs> well, you just start collecting now and then do that for about 27 years. And then you okay. too will have a good collection of them. 27 years. There you go. Now I'm not happy with my watches. <laughs> I really like how you put those faces in the watches. That is so cool, Shannon. Oh, it's fun. We might have to copy that. Yeah, we might have to. My dear. Feel that idea from you. Yeah, but we'll have to give her credit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, that's no fun. Mary, made your glue concoction of Elmer's glue. I just used the school glue that I get at Walmart <laughs> and I fill it three fourths full, three parts of glue to. I, I really need to clean out this glue pot. Three parts of glue to a little less than one one part of water. You kind of have to mix your water by feel and touch and however you like it. I have but it thins that glue down a little. I what were you saying? A really old video. Let me show you, Mary. Who, who is that? Vicky? Vicky. Okay, let me put it on Vicky. Hold on a minute here. This is cool wait a minute it has to flip over to you okay it's still on shannon the wi-fi has to flip over there you go all right go this is a sealer box it's got a real strong seal on it silicone and you pop the top off and three kitchen sponges in here and i put a whole Bottle, bottle and a half of the blue. It can be any Elmer's. But this has been in here now for two years. And it's not molded. And it's still plenty wet to stick to. That's cool. And I've, there's a video um, on my site. On your site of how to do that. Yeah, it's it's really cool, and I've I've used it an awful lot. Thanks for sharing that, Vicky. That was a brilliant idea. So it's something I picked up for some elementary school teachers, and they said the kids it stopped a lot of the glue drying out in the bottles problem. Tanya's gonna go feed her hubby. Bye, Tanya. Thanks for popping in. Y'all have fun now, she said. <laughs> Tanya streams tomorrow at noon central, and uh, she does her totally junk, junk journal. And I'm amazed that she's 
she's done that for several weeks now. I mean, a lot of weeks, 18, 20, 25 weeks. I don't know how many weeks, but wow. it's getting up there. I filled one and she started another, but <sighs> hi, Red Wagon. Welcome, welcome. They're saying goodbye to Tanya. Red Wagon must be Renee. She said I could call her red, so. Thirty-five weeks for Tanya? Wow. Tag him. That's a lot of weeks to do wow. junk journaling. No ADD for her. No ADD. She's always coming up with really cool ideas, too. Y'all, this might be interesting. Y'all will see it. We'll be the judge of that. We'll what? <laughs> yeah. Rosemary's going to judge it. This is vintage 70s onion skin paper. Oh, onion. Oh, 70s onion skin oh. paper. Oh. Yeah. Because it has 25% cotton in it. Back when we used to use tap riders. Uh, yeah, yeah. This was mm -hmm. uh, this was a ream of the paper that somebody had a name for it. They told me what it was called. Uh, it's kind of like their second sheets, or you know, it's a anyway. It's a really pretty paper. So then I looked for things that I liked. Um. Japanesey things. Randy's half Japanese. And then printed them through my inkjet printer onto this paper. Oh, on the, the onion skin. Uh-huh. That's cool. It came off pretty good. I'm oh, yeah. I'm so sorry. Red Wagon says that she has onion skin paper in her Etsy, if any of you are interested. Serenity says, cool, I love all things 70s. Mary, you shared the formula and I made some. <laughs> How's that working for you, Serenity? Is it working for you? You kind of have to be the judge of your own uh, your water that you add, depending on how thick you want your glue. What else is going on out here in chat? Allie Kay is here. Hi, Allie Kay. Allie Kay is my Wisconsin youngster. <laughs> I call her a youngster. <laughs> She's a youngin. She, I call her my smarty pants, too. She, she was translating German or Danish for us last night. Did you ever figure out what that was? Uh, I'm going to ask Linda McAllister because um, she's she's in the Netherlands. If it if it's Swedish or German, she might know. Mm -hmm. I think Linda speaks several languages. We know she speaks Dutch and English, <laughs> and I'll bet she knows some German and Swedish. But uh, yeah, I think that I, it's a Bible. We know that because of the chapters and verses. Right. Yeah. So yeah, we were having fun with that. <laughs> I like the genealogy part of it, though, in the front section of it. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see what else is going out here. You like it? Okay. One thing about that Elmer's glue that I'm still a little bit unsure of, I would hesitate. If you're doing a journal that, I mean, like, we, I'm working in my art journal, so I don't care. But uh, I know from experience that Elmer's glue will, well, if you look at my, here, let's just go on to me for a minute. I've got this scrapbook that I got at Goodwill. And 
um, if you look through these pages, you'll see stuff like this where it's yellowing and look at this. This was, this was probably put on with glue at one point. And I'm thinking, you look at this right in here. Um, some of these glues will turn your papers brown as it ages. Now, if you don't mind that, it's okay. But uh, I kind of, when I use my Elmer's glue, I sometimes think that it's, you have to be, you know, you have to not care what's going to happen in 10 years. Um, and I think that sometimes when I use Elmer's glue, I kind of hesitate. But for my journaling, this is all about nursing. And I, I decided to sketch this lady here. I'm sketching her over here. <laughs> Let's go look at Shannon and her head, her faces. Look at that. That guy you have in that one watch looks like that guy on, um, oh, that makes all those funny stories on that Joe's, uh, is it Joe's on, Jerry's on, who is that? <laughs> I can't like remember. Mike, not Jerry. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's who he reminds me of, though. Yeah, he does. <laughs> And then you got all those pretty ladies. Yes, and their faces are just the right size. Yeah. And look at that face yeah. right by the Jerry's. Jerry's. Yeah, that one. Isn't that funny. <laughs> I love her. Like I'm stuck in here. <laughs> yep. She look good in that one. And then you just take an exacto knife and cut the face out of the claw. Yeah. Easy breezy. Oh, I've got to do at least one like that. <laughs> yeah. I'll say, I learned it from Shannon. It's all her fault. <laughs> Let's go look at Rosemary, see what she's up to. Ooh, frames. Frames? Frames. I put oh, it on frames. her. I think it's a brains, like brains. You know, oh no, brains. She, you wouldn't put brains <laughs> and rosemary in one sentence. Oh, you're working on that idea page that you're not sharing with us. No, I'm working on my uh, guess spine. Oh, oh, you were. Oh, I was going to work in my spine journal, wasn't I? Oops. <laughs> <laughs> we'll just leave that one on the shelf a little longer. <laughs> What did I do? Oh, here we go. I was getting like Mary. I lost my scissors. They were in my yeah. Hand. I don't know what happened to that stamp. That really frustrates me. But after after the stream is over and I kind of clean up here, it'll show up. You're gonna have to let us all know where it was. <clears throat> you know what I was thinking? You kept talking about your cat, and maybe you locked him up somewhere. I thought you were talking about a real cat. A real cat. <laughs> we don't own a cat. We don't own a real one. We just have we have strays. <laughs> and I have to tell you guys, we have this yellow Garfield cat that comes by, and he's really friendly. And uh, I put out fresh water for him, and clean out the bowl when I water my plants. And then we've got this old, and, and it's a pretty bowl, and I clean out it all out for him, everything. And we got this other pan that's all moldy and dirty, and it catches rainwater. And when that cat comes over to get a drink, do you think he'll drink the fresh water? No, <laughs> he goes right for the moldy pan. And I don't understand it. The only he thing needs, I can he needs think the nutrients. Yeah, well, <laughs> either that or. Maybe that can't see. I got that bowl from Dollar Tree, and I'm thinking that maybe it might have something in it that that cat knows. That do you think that you know a plastic in there that that cat won't drink out of it or something? Oh, maybe. You know, he may be smarter than I give him credit for, but I think it's pretty dumb when he's got fresh water and he goes <laughs> out of the old moldy bowl. <laughs> Miss Allie Kay says, anyone go to Target this afternoon? They told me their computer system was down nationwide. No one could check anything out. But on the bright side, they were handing out free popcorn and water. <laughs> <laughs> wow. And we don't have a Target in our area, so. I haven't left the house today, so. Me either. 
We've all been at home, Allie Kay. Let's see, Susan says her cats do the same thing. They drink the old nasty water in the driveway. I haven't figured that out about cat. Mode tastes better. <laughs> Eva said that she worked this morning and Target was just fine. Oh, Serenity said it smells fishy. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> makes sense. Hi, Turtle. Turtle Creativity, welcome, welcome. It's all he knows, Serenity says. That could be. I mean, maybe just out of habit, because we did have that aluminum pan before I got the... I bought that bowl especially for clean water for those cats. I paid a whole dollar for it. <laughs> and that cat won't drink out of it. <laughs> But that cat is a sneaky cat, too. But it's a friendly cat. It's friendly. It lets me... I talk to it. It lets me pet it. And... Azure says, driveway water is dangerous if you have antifreeze leaks. It will kill a cat. There you go. I would imagine, don't you think cats would would shy away from an antifreeze, though? No, it's sweet. Oh, yeah. They, go, they actually gravitate toward it. Oh, really? Yeah. So, Allie Kay, did you have to go put everything back on the shelf? Or did you have to, you couldn't buy it, I suppose. I would, gosh, if I were the clerks, I would write it by hand. <laughs> They probably wouldn't let them do it by hand, though. Do it the old-fashioned way. They don't know how to do it the old-fashioned They can't even give you money back the old-fashioned They can't make change. Uh -uh. Well, that's probably the problem. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. That would be the problem, wouldn't it? Mm -hmm. <coughs> Excuse me. Well, y'all, they look like they're in diving helmets. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. Who's in diving helmets? Let's go back to the watches. They look like those old fashioned big oh. diving helmets, you know? Or astronauts. Yeah. I may just put them all three on there and leave them like that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear me. I like them, though. Oh, that's, that's cute. <laughs> <laughs> Shannon, I'll bet you're a great storyteller, aren't you? <laughs> when I have a story to tell, I can tell a good story. <laughs> I just can't think of a good story right now. You got one right in front of you with those three divers. Whoa, make up a story about them? Yeah, what were they diving for? Some sort of jewels? Well, this is the mom and her um, two daughters. Mm -hmm. And she told her daughters, there's always more fish in the sea. And they took her literally. <laughs> so they put on their driving helmets because, you know, they're not that bright. <laughs> but they're special. And they're special. <laughs> now, they're hunting for husbands. <laughs> And you see the connection. Oh, I see a connection. <laughs> They've got that. That's a. Uh, what do you call it when the watches have the jewel something? What is that? What? You know how watches have. What is it? Watch. <laughs> I forgot what they have. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Faces. No, and no, bands. no. Inside, they have their, the jewels, right? The jewel movement quartz. Yeah, because they call it jewel, jewel something, right? When they rephrase, when they advertise. Oh, the um, the um. Oh my God! You know See? what? See, you the don't crystal. remember either. Watch crystal. Anyway, but they say jewel movement, right? Because they oh have the crystal jewel movement. That's supposed to be some kind of a big deal. And the old I just thought of something. I'll be right back. Uh, uh, well, uh, uh, well, excuse me. 
Break the connection, people. Listen to me. I finished these two pages. It was a long stretch. They, she's got the, the thing on her head to go submerge herself in. Uh -huh. She's got a jewel watch on her head. And Jewel Byrne was the one that wrote the story <laughs> about <laughs> 20 leagues under the sea. There's a connection there somehow. If you if you mess up the words. Oh my God! Only in your brain <laughs> would you get that. <laughs> Only in yours. But it, you do see the connection, right? I see the connection, Rosemary. Thank you. All you need is an octopus, and it's done. <laughs> Y'all ever yeah, seen yeah, my I agree. All you need is the octopus. <laughs> I'm over here being serious, and y'all are playing. You want to see my two, my spread? I finished. Well, I, okay. right. I just moved it. I just moved it. Let me go back. You want to get serious? Let me go back, Vicky. Just give there. We're on you, Vicky. You're on. Oh, right here. There's Vicky's two-page spread. Are you calling that done or? Yep. Well, that's a minimalist. It's minimalist. Yes. And you said when I watched your stream when you were doing that stenciling, you got that from eye stencils, didn't you? Is that a? Oh, uh, uh, what's her name? Uh, what's her name? I keep forgetting her name. Uh, um, this thing is from the woman is from um, Noon in the Micro. Who did the stencil up on your left hand corner? The Japanese or Chinese? Oh, that's a piece of paper I printed from the internet. Oh. Okay. Uh, on the rice paper. Oh, then I'm wrong. I, I thought that was you did that with a stencil. No, it could be easy enough, but Okay, ignore what I said. All right. Well, I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna go on these are put from my printouts on uh, onion skin too. Ooh. Nice. And then you looks like you're starting a face over there on your right hand side. Oh, that's just a off print from oh. extra ink. Oh, okay. Okay. I can't find an octopus, but I found a squid. Yay! Oh, let, me, let me pop over to Shannon. She found a squid. Ooh, look at that squid. <laughs> what does squid do, Rosemary? Yes, ma'am. Look what else I found. I have watch crystals. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> look at a watch crystal, Rosemary. I can actually put bubbles on them. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> I love, it. I love it. I'm dying from awesome. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are nuts. The supply queen herself. Look at that. <laughs> Hi, Barbara Clark. Welcome, welcome. Patty Tolly Parish. Thank you, Rejoice Joyce. Thank you, thank you. I keep forgetting Patty Tolly Parish's name. I don't know why. It Too just many words. Too many words. You can't forget Patty. I don't know why. She just every time I want to remember her, it just my mind goes blank. PPP. <laughs> PPP. That's it. Barb says, hello, Mary. You guys are having so much fun. Uh, Shannon, Rosemary, and Vicki make this fun. They do, haven't they? They just made a total fun afternoon. Mary's oh. fun. Mary's fun. <laughs> Mary lost her kitty stamp. Yeah. Mary spends her afternoon looking for stuff. <laughs> I know. It ran away to Arkansas. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Shannon, you don't have any animals, though, do you? Do you have an animal at your house? I like no, them. not anymore. After our last dog died, I, I, it just tore me up. Yeah. And I can't do it yet. 
you just got a soft heart. You don't want to see another animal. Yeah. I get that. My dad was that way. I know. I'm going to carve one for Beth tomorrow night during my... Oh, I'm going to... Uh, I might as well say it. Tomorrow night on Sunday night, I'm going to do a marathon where I'm going to stream. And I'm going to work on unfinished projects. Oh, my God. I love that. And then I'll find my stamp so I can finish my three-by-three three cards. <laughs> but I'll carve another... I told Beth Schuler that I'd, that I'd carve another stamp for her, or a kitty stamp for her. Look what I found with a cool name like that. I found an octopus. Uh-oh. I like that squid, though. Oh, you first. do have an octopus. Oh, oh wow. Ooh, that's a creepy cool. one. You can intertwine the people. <laughs> yes. Out the little cut out. thing in the like bottom. The, like the octopus has got him in his clutches. Yes, just like the book. <laughs> You missed that part of the story, Shannon. <laughs> Just like the book. Ooh, where'd that come from? Okay. Well, we're watching Shannon do her trick with that octopus. Watching me fussy cat, isn't this fun? Yes, oh, we are. I don't like watching those things live. <laughs> <laughs> Weren't we just talking the other day that I'm making Yes, nervous? you make me nervous. You know, sometimes people have a live where they're using that guillotine cutter thingamajigger. I don't watch. <laughs> if somebody's doing a live and they're cutting the papers with one of those, Adios, amigo. I'm history. I don't want to see a finger falling off live. <laughs> so I figure, I figure if it shows up on a repeat, well, that means everything was okay. So <laughs> <laughs> then it's safe to watch. Otherwise, oh, dear. I get out my utility knife when I open Happy Mail, when I cut my tiles apart. <laughs> mm. I'm doing a, a tunnel, a tunnel journal right now. Oh, let me go to let me go to Rosemary. Who's and I, no, 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 no. I don't mean right now, right now, right now. Oh, oh well, then <laughs> go back to planning. <laughs> I don't mean that kind of right now. <laughs> it's just one of my projects right now. And Allie Kay says, "Mary, you just carved it last night. How could you lose it? I was using it today." I don't know what happened to it. It was in her hand and then it was gone. Yeah, then it just it creeped away. All right. Continue on, Rosemary. I interrupted you. No, I mean I I don't like knives. I don't like, you know, I don't like any of those kinds of things. It just like I literally feel my skin just crawl. But mm -hmm. I started this um this journal, which I have to cut stuff out, and I actually had fun. I don't understand it. You had fun? I had fun. And it was like, well, I'm getting evil. I like to chop, chop stuff. <laughs> but I still, don't, I still don't want to see someone else's finger flopping off during a live. So I, I won't watch the guillotine stuff. Well, here's the difference, Rosemary. You have control over what you're doing. But if you're watching, you never know what's going to happen exactly. to someone else's finger. Exactly. So if it happens and you see it, you you know you go oh. I don't I don't want to know nothing about it. I don't want to see it. I don't want to hear the screams. No. I you ever watch that commercial? I don't see it much anymore. But it was a YouTube commercial or a Facebook commercial where they have this person standing in a you know like a zoo enclosed area and the tiger you know behind a glass wall and the tiger's mm -hmm. creeping up on him. And you just know that tiger's going to jump at any minute. <laughs> and when it does, you jump too, you know? And you even jump when it repeats, when you know it's going to happen. Yeah. Well, I'm bad. You know, a lot of those, a lot of you guys like watching, you know, scary 
shows and movies and series. Not me. I don't like them. They make me nervous. They literally make me nervous. I don't watch them either. Rosemary. And so, I you know, why would I sit down and spend two hours making myself nervous? I'd rather have a cup of coffee <laughs> at night. You know what I'm saying? A cup of coffee. Just tea. give me a cup of coffee. I'll get just as jittery. <laughs> and I'll have the stamina to stay up and work, you know? <laughs> yes, I do. Okay, how's that look? Oh, that's Cooper. Cool. That is so neat, Shannon. See how she came up with that? Just, just, um, just here. You weren't planning what? that out for three weeks. Oh, wow, Rosemary came up with it. Yeah. yeah. Oh, no, no, no. You put the heads on the people. I just gave the narrative. <laughs> Rosemary said you need an octopus. So Shannon said, I got an octopus. I got one. <laughs> now first I, I got a squid and then head. I got an octopus. Ew. I'm seeing oh that's Shannon's book. Yeah. No, I'm gonna save my squid. He doesn't yeah, know. I'm gonna save the squid too. The octopus is enough. <laughs> I want to see the octopus again. The it's on now. On there right now. See it? You know what this is? This was an advertisement for a, something Walt Disney and the Little Mermaid, and that's Ursula. If that tells you how long I've had. Oh wow! You know what you should do? I know you have a zillion eyeballs. You need to put the eyeballs inside of those little suction cup of thing, Virginia. <laughs> Now she's off on eyeballs. <laughs> well, it looks like they need some eyeballs in there. Oh, At least yeah. one or two. Let me Shannon, I've got eyeballs. eyeballs. I've got eyeballs. Just a minute. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here's the eyeball section. <laughs> Rosemary says octopus. You go off and get it. <laughs> Rosemary says eyeballs. I've got them. <laughs> but does she have the right size? Quit showing. I have off. no idea. You got to be the right size, Shannon. Yeah. I've got it in my mind. I just have to find it in your mind's eye. <laughs> in my mind's eye. I see the eyeballs. Just the right size. Let me look. Let's just keep punning it, people. Okay. It's an advertisement, and I don't know which one of these I put it in. I feel like it's this one. <laughs> Eyeballs. Eyeballs. Oh, look at that. Eyeball. Look at those eyeballs. My gosh. But you know what? I bet I have a punch. <gasps> that would just punch yeah. out the track. You need a half inch punch. I bet I don't know. But I bet they're they're probably about the right size. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Yes, it'll work. You guys, we've got six minutes left. Oh, no, the pressure is on. I know. I kind of want to do a review. Let's go back over to Rosemary. We know Shannon has put together this really creepy page with the art <laughs> and eyeballs. Aww. Let's go see what Rosemary's doing. What are you working in, Rosemary? Oh, I'm trying to finish up my, um, Your spine, my journal. Um, spine journal. I've just finished. Few more pieces to put in and i all i think i might be done oh if i do it a little bit later on tonight i think i might actually be done i'm so yeah. used to get on to my next project i'm so tired of having multiple projects going yeah i want to get them done so this one it's so close to being done that after you glue that down will you do a really fast flip so that the gals can see the journal i have it up Move it up an inch after you get that glued down. Is that up. Good? Yeah, up. Okay. Yeah, there you go. Alrighty. 
Wow. All right. So I don't know if they're all done yet, but at least they're done enough for me to move on. Yeah, look at that. Good job. How cool is that? Now you're doing black and white pages there. Are you choosing that? Is that or that just how it fell when you were working it? No, I chose to do a black and white journal with just a little bit of red. Yeah, how cool is that? Wow. I gotta put that in. That's coming off, so I gotta redo that. But this is like an interactive oh. thing of yeah. with the whole story, but I gotta put that back together for another day. Okay. okay. Ooh, I like that page. Very nice. There's that red feather. Is that a red feather? Yeah, that was a. Uh, whoops, that was a happy mail. Wow. Oh, I like that. Let's look at that. And I had to put a little bit of red on her shoe. I put some sparklies. Wow. Blockers. And very cool. Oh, look, the famous picture. Uh, <laughs> what is that? <laughs> <laughs> I wonder. <laughs> and then the flip side. Oh, you did both sides in black and white. Oh, cool. Mm -hmm. With a touch of red. Oh, you like just these, This right here is not done. I know that already. Yeah, you just worked on that. Yeah. Oh, cool. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Boo, hoo, hoo, hoo. Ooh, I like that one too. Very cool. Very nice. That's it. Wow. Oh, it's done. I'm so excited. How cool is that? That is awesome. Let's go look at Vicky. Let's see so what she Vicky. Vicky, Vicky what, you're, you're working. Are you still working on the onion skin paper? Yeah. I just did this the 1970s. Wow. Some washi tape I made. Yeah. Oh, yeah. She made some cool washi tape the other day. And I'm going to put this on this side Ooh. with something from this probably down at the bottom. Uh-huh. Very Maybe. nice. I don't know. And then show you saw it. Yeah. And show us your face again because that's what I really liked. <laughs> your painting. There we go. So talented. So oh, thank very you. talented. Just Excellent. Beautiful. And, it, and you did it, you know, in what? An hour and a half, maybe? Roughly. Roughly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wow. Very cool. I did. Uh, <clears throat> played, <clears throat> played with toning down some pages in the front that needed. Well, where are they? They were so bright because this is Delusion's thing. Yeah. To make it go with the rest of the journal, yeah. I don't remember where I did them now. Right here. Really made them quiet. Yeah. Quiet. Oh, that quiet them down. That's yeah. all I did today. Yep. All I did. Well, that's it. I uh, let's see. What did I do? I I tore my ink pens apart and put them in my alcohol ink, and I cut my page my tiles apart and I lost my stamp and right now <laughs> right now I'm working in this scrapbook that I got at Goodwill and it's all about a school of nursing oh, and I, yeah and I sketched this little lady here from from this I'm not quite done with it I just kind of started I but you know I'm you for scrapbook paper this is really a nice this is not like your cardstock paper this is a nice paper I'm seeing Shannon now. Where are you? Okay. Oh, I'm not. I'm there now. Your Wi-Fi is lagging. Yeah. 
Okay, let's bop back over to Shannon. And yeah, okay, let me bop back over to Shannon. And we'll probably need to say goodbye. Yep, to everybody. Yep. Shannon's yep. off the prism of the eyes. <laughs> got my balls. She's got her eyeballs on there, guys. And I'm gonna glue Yay! them down and then I'm gonna put on their little finish their helmets. <laughs> How <laughs> cool. That, that, yeah. On your arm, you just bubble. perfect phrase to go on here or something. Yeah. You just do. So creative, Shannon. Just cool. very creative. I don't know. Shannon you can share and, and post story. your finish. Fun stuff. There you go. I love it. Very nice. And I want to thank you all for coming, all of you that are still sticking with us. Yes, thank you, Shannon, thank for you. being on. Our mod, Janet, Janet is in here keeping all the chatters Thank in line. Thank you, Janet. Thank we love you. you. And thank I'm you all for one. coming and keeping us company. Thanks, everyone. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So bye, everybody. Bye-bye. Thanks. Thank you, gals, for hanging out with me. You all bet. Right. It's time. All right. Thank you. Oh, we're going to get Rosemary and Jersey. Oh, uh, uh, yeah. They're next. So look we're going to close down next. the internet. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, everybody. Bye.